Hey, bam, bam, bam. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, welcome to Go Go Plays with himself. I am the huge white kid, idiot Dave Coco from Wrestle AM, a podcast exclusively on YouTube Coco Sports. We are live on Twitch Coco Sports and YouTube Coco Sports. And archived on YouTube Coco Plays, thanks to Sid's Light. We are powered by Stream Raiders, Pokemon in the chat. And if you are on the Twitch machine, you can hit Command Play for one of the skins down there. So it should be awesome. Or a free subscription or a gifted subscription. It's up to you. We serve the one and only King Raptor Man. And this is Coco Sports Stream and E-Fed with half real wrestlers, half chatters. All awesome. And we are inside the Coco Sports Kingdom in Yokohama, Japan. This is the road to Turkey Mania. This Friday night is Turkey Mania. The clickbait match tonight is the UFC boxing greatest of all time. That's right. Watch our UFC 5 series. Mike Tyson, the Dynamite Kid, Iron Mike, the King of New Jersey. Hey, walks on water, boys. Mike Tyson, and he'll be going up against Stone Cold Steve Austin. One, I believe this feud is the reason why WWE won the Monday Night Wars, and I believe AOL Time Warner is the reason they WCW lost the Monday Night Wars. So there we go. All right, we got some live chat going down on the YouTube machine. We got Hayabusa is the best there is, was, but the best high flying wrestlers will ever be. Bret Hart reference. Yeah, um, I got to meet him. He's a really nice guy. Hi Hayabusa. I, I regret because I, I didn't get my picture taken with him. I was like, oh, I don't know. I, I, I One of my biggest regrets in working with media and wrestling is I didn't take more selfies. You weren't supposed to in media. And Randy Harris is like, fuck that. And he has like so many great pictures. And me, I'm like, I met him. So nowadays, I'm just going to ask everyone for a picture. Like, that's it. Picture it up, boys. We need a Taguchi and a bank of heads. All right. Tyson doesn't do well in Japan. Uh-oh, you're right. You're right. <laughs> I have to get another Otani jersey. Damn Dodgers. Ah! HBK L underscore Omatic. Uh, great guy, podcaster, streamer, YouTuber. Make sure to check him out. But even though I love HBK underscore Omatic, I don't want to fucking lie. I am so jealous. He has one of the most beautiful lightning jerseys of all time, and I want to steal it. Maybe I'll have to buy one my own. Uh, HBK has the, the outdoor game lightnings with the Captain C. Uh, Bolts and the Lightning Stammy jersey. Oh, it's so hot. He was born in Brooklyn. And I know, but he's the god of New Jersey. Hello, Archive. What do you think of Mike Tyson joining DX? What do you guys think, YouTube? Damn you, Dodgers. Hayabusa injury is scary as fuck, too. Take all the pitches. I know, I regret. I regret. I was a professional, and I shouldn't have. Ah, uh, there we go. Uh-oh. What do we got? Has he made Atlantic City a ton of money? There you go. Oh, yeah, he made Atlantic City a ton of money. Plus, like, it was so funny, too, because, like, um, I remember I remember when Mike Tyson was accused of his crime, and no one, no one cared. Like, like, as a kid, when Mike Tyson was accused of his crime, not one fucking person in my neighborhood gave a fuck. They were just like, he's innocent. Who gives a shit? Even if he ain't, fucker. And I was like, holy shit. I don't think he did it, but I I also think that uh, people in New Jersey needed no proof. <laughs> like, the people I grew up with. Uh, be triggered internet? Yeah. National Stadium Series jersey? 10 out of 10? Hell yeah. Chase Passion? Be mindful of warning to obsession? One will fulfill. The other will never be enough. Cena. Exactly. <laughs> Tyson, FDR. So reverse Twitter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was completely reverse Twitter. Nowadays, everyone's guilty until fucking never. You're just guilty. You're like, I, I actually have proof I've never done it. You're like, uh-uh, uh-uh. I've already decided you did it. <laughs> what if, dude, what if you were committed by a crime? What if a crime was committed by you and... You didn't get you didn't get a uh, uh, you didn't get a jury of your peers, but you just got random people on Twitter. I, I just thought, all right, I, I'll lock myself away. Not a Twitter's guilty even when you're innocent. Yeah, guilty until proven innocent. See, until he wrote that himself and didn't Google that. Exactly, exactly. I still think 
Cena had Cena got AI earlier than everyone else. I just think he, Chat GPT. He was like he was one of the test markets. James Buster Douglas with Mike Tyson and Tokyo Dome reference. Yep. Oh god. Oh god. What 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 happened? What happened? That's from our good friend on the Red Machine 13 King style. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe on the Red Machine, and make sure to hit command play on the Purple Machine. 50k on Tyson. See, it is AI. The man is a robot. You might be right. I love that people like me, Sid's Light, um, Domo, they're like, Stolen Valor. Oh, man, John Cena's a great person. <laughs> My favorite saying ever is from a Chinese soldier, and it describes the human race. A lot of people say it describes China. I think it describes the human race. The, a Ch I talked to a Chinese soldier when I was serving, and he said the greatest thing in the world. And it describes the human race in social media. You, you attack and kill the pirates all day. But you best look the other way when the king comes walking by. It describes humanity. It's just fucking humanity got it. It's like, alright. Yeah, if you haven't yet and you're on a Twitch machine, hey, there's a Pokemon. B, command, play. You can win a stream editor skid. Or... Or possibly so, uh, uh, free subscription or gift a subscription. It's up to you. But you gotta be in it to win it! I learned that from 1980s uh, lotto commercials. <laughs> Dude, uh, Japan has like one giant lottery a year. And people are waiting around like through lines forever. So like once a year there's like just one giant lottery. Sid's light, thank you. We got some LIJ matches tonight. The three uh, social media titles will be on the line. Uh, YouTube, we'll have to we'll have to have. Uh... Jesus Christ! Did you see the animation on that? That was pretty fucking cool. That was a pretty cool fucking animation, dude. Oh, drop kick! Damn, Tyson ain't fucking around. He's like, I'm the goat. The GOAT! <laughs> Kings beat the Jets. Oh, Connor Renee got the got it. Oh Jesus. Mike Tyson, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Going at it, boys. So Nope, still can't find a Medal of Honor segment. Just looked again. <laughs> you gotta find it. Me and Sid, we might have talked that for an hour. Yeah, we might have talked about that for fucking an hour on stream. It was ridiculous. Two Twitch titles will be online tonight. One YouTube title. Mike Tyson is a GOAT. Friday night is Turkey Mania. And after a couple matches tonight, after this show, we'll be playing some NHL. If Sam is up, we owe him a 1v1. And maybe we'll do a little be a pro. Oh, Jesus. Big Ash! Big Ash! We, we're going to try to beat two bosses, Big Ash. Big Ash, thank you for the epic. We got your flag. Um, we're going we're gonna to try to do uh, two bosses. Dude, Big Ash, two nights in a row we made it up to the boss and died. Oh no. So we, we need we need your help tonight, Big Ash. Guys, if you're if you're on no matter where you are, stream uh or wherever you're watching this stream, make sure to go to Stream Raiders. Ooh, El Generico. Make sure to go to uh, streamraiders.com and look for Coco Sports. Uh, 13 King Style on the YouTube machine says, For real, Dave, I think Mike Tyson and Steve Austin should have wrestled for the WWF Championship WrestleMania in real life. That would have drew a lot of money in the booking of wrestling world. 100%. 100%. I, I just think it would probably be hard to get Tyson to do it at the time, but I could be wrong. I missed you all. I got to go. My migraine is it way longer. Good luck for the rest of the stream, y'all. Connor Renee, don't be a stranger, and thank you for being awesome. There you go. Connor Renee, I like your little emotes. I think it was pitch. Tyson versus Austin the match. I guaranteed you it was pitch. Oh, 100%. Wait a second. 
Is Stone Cold gonna win by count out? I, I don't think Crash wants that to end like that. Crash Andrew this for referee. There we go. Oh, Stone Cold Stunner! Stone Cold Stunner! He just went from GOAT, Sabu. He went from GOAT to uh, get knocked the fuck out. Uh, let's see, is the quick count quick enough? Tyson. He's the GOAT at boxing, now the GOAT at MMA. Could he be the GOAT at pro wrestling? <laughs> yeah, I hope you feel better, Connor Renee. Salute. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Tyson knocked out. There we go. Wait a second. Could the power of Tyson? Nope. Two count only. Two count only. All right. Guys, should we put a time limit on loser and Japan matches? And if the time is up, they're both belated? Like 10 minute matches? And if, if it ends up being a tie, both belated? Yes, yes. All right. We got some belated LIJ matches tonight. Five minutes? <laughs> We're just going to bleed everyone. Bleed to the left, bleed to the right. Mike Tyson wins. It's an all Mike Tyson night. He's guaranteed to be in the Twitch Championship match. Let's do it, boys. Let's do it. Damn, look at the... That that animation fucking is... is uh, fucking the met. It's just awesome. There we go. Belit Steve Austin? I wish I could bleed. Uh, well, I wouldn't bleed Steve Austin, but I wish I could bleed the WWE guys. Like, I don't think we need Spanky or Sparky or Spooky, whatever the fuck that giant tall dude's name is. But we can delete him. Instant classic. Tab 2. In my opinion, Tyson vs. Austin is the 90s, but it's sold out MetLife Stadium. Yeah. Yeah, Shanky's the guy. I would delete Shanky instantly. I'd be like, all right, there's a spot. All right, instant classic. Congrats, Mike Tyson. All right, Twitch title on the line. Let's get. Let's make sure everyone gets a shot at getting someone in. Uh, there we go. Who's the Twitch champ? Oh, it's goddamn Sam Besser, the real champ. Sam, are you going to go double champs on this? He's not, but you know, he is getting the fucking opportunity. You know he's not going to, but we can give him the opportunity. We can give him a we can do Oh, it's Adam Cole? Never mind. Sam, go fuck yourself. <laughs> I love you, Sam. Adam Cole is the champ. All right, let's see. We're scrolling. Billy. Oh, uh, Mike Tyson has to be here because he won the clickbait, you know, and he's a goat in two, two sports, possibly three. Could it be an all Mike Tyson? Shanky, really? Uh, are you guys picking Shanky? Sam is YouTube champ. Adam is Twitch champ. Got it. And then Paps, baby. Uh, we'll start on Andy Paps. I'm not putting Shanky in unless someone says it again because I don't know. There you go. Andy Paps is in. Yo, what's up, phenomenal bag chasers? I, I see that sometimes you're going live on kick. I got to check in. Thank you, yo. Matthew K. All right, let's get Matthew K. Do you think Iron Mike should be WWE champion for the press? Uh, should have been. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. If, yeah. I, I honestly think if it's not Mike Tyson and Stone Cold... WCW uh, takes out WWE. I think that's a turning point that enough people don't realize. Brian Danielson. All right, let's get the American Dragon. All right, let's get Matthew K. Brian Danielson. All right, and... There we go. Braun Breaker. A lot of Braun Breaker action lately. All right, if you're not in, you're going to have to try again later. All right, let's see. Braun Breaker. Who's getting a coupon, boys? Hopefully, Kurt is in 2K24 so I could run him and Braun. That'd be nice. Shanky. Nope, too late. Uh, yes, sir. Not doing bad. CM Punk missed out. Twitch is allowing nudity now. I saw. I saw. Basically, softcore porn site. Yeah. Ron Breaker, please. Uh, really? I still think since uh, Twerk is allowed on Twitch, when is Coco going to get low for us? Oh, yeah, boys. <laughs> Hide my nipples. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Where's those biddies? <laughs> Coco, you can be nude now? Subs are on sale. Get your subs now. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe. 
Alright, what do we got here? I'm scared. Entrance is off. Title on. Championship. Twitch champion. Alright, here we go. Like the good old days. Just put the <laughs> pasties on your nipples. Yeah. I just don't, I don't understand. A a as an old man, I do not understand OnlyFans and Twitch sexy women. Because, like, there's just porn everywhere. I, I, I That part of my brain doesn't work. That part of my brain does not work. No pad stream returns. Hell yeah. Who knows? Maybe not where I'm at. Do I gets Coco a 1 to 10% boost? Thank you, Tight Spot. Porn. Porn everywhere. I don't I don't get it. I, I don't get it. I, I do remember one time, though. I don't want to say who it is, but there was a woman streamer. And I, Adam Cole and Mike Tyson starting it off. Champ first clickbait winner. So, champ and clickbait disadvantage. Both of them got it. Nah, you remember I was watching a women's streamer, and she was playing NHL. And I was like, man, she, she, she's a good streamer. And out of nowhere, she's like, all right, it's body paint time. And took off her shirt and started rubbing her titties. And I was like, what, where the fuck did this plot twist come from? <laughs> it's like out of nowhere. She's like, yeah, I like playing NHL. All right, the game's over. It's titty time. I'm like, I did not see this plot twist coming. I think he was asking if you like Mike Tyson should have been WHA. Oh, yeah, I 100% I agree. I think he should have been. I, I, yeah, without a doubt. I mean, because think about it. It's not, because here's the thing. If you got, like, athletic, legit backgrounds and you have the media and you're WWF or WWE, I don't think it matters. <laughs> That's not what he meant by sticks out. <laughs> I, I just didn't see it coming. All right, Daniel Bryan said, what? Stream Raiders is free to play with in-game purchases. If you are on the purple machine, make sure to hit command play. Make sure to hit command play. Do it now, boys. All right, here we go. Oh, we, we, oh, we got some units out here. We got some units out here. We got some units out here. Let's go get ready to kick some ass here, boys. Let's poison some people up, and we're going to make it happen. We got some raptors. We got a pirate. We got awkward in Japan. We got a bear friend. And now it is time to destroy. Destroy everyone. There we go. The Twitch title will be online later. The YouTube title, also LIJ. 20, <laughs> NHL 24, sponsored by Hooters. I, it just, like... It came out of nowhere. Like, I didn't see it coming. I didn't see it. I did not. It was just like, what? what, what is going on right now? What? What, what is going on? <laughs> I mean, I, I, she just out of nowhere. She's like, hey, guys. I played some NHL. Yeah, my favorite, my favorite team is blah, blah, blah. My favorite player is this. I'm like, this is cool. All right, I get down with this. And then, BAM! Painted boobies. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck is going on? Uh, there we go. Alright, what do I gotta do here, boys? What do I have to do here? I guess, you know what? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. The big ass flag is out, boys. The big ass flag is out. I need some assists. Let's get some assists. I'm going to be like John Stockton over here. All right, back to the match. Release the boobs. Man, I love the leaves. And also, here are my boobs. Exactly. I was like, what the hell? Let me see the hockey books. Yo, hockey and boobies. Sounds like it ain't Saturday night. Some Birch, thank you for the epic war beast. Hugsleyberry, thank you. Oh, man. It, it, it was definitely different. It's definitely... It was definitely a surprise. <laughs> oh, man. And the best part is, you know that's when, like, your the female in your life's gonna come. Your wife, you know, maybe it's your wife, your girlfriend, your sister, your mom. Whatever female lives in your house, you're just watching good old NHL fucking Let's Play. And then, BAM! She walks in going, uh, why are you watching this girl paint her titties? Uh, it's a hockey thing, hon. You wouldn't understand. <laughs> hey, Coco, Hawk, Coco, does NHL make you want to get naked? I mean, I, I guess so. Maybe throw my pants, a little Ric Flair. <laughs> Are you really a fan if you don't get naked and watch your favorite team? 
<laughs> These are good questions, AJ. That's probably it looks like Eric Young, in my opinion. Yeah, I, I, I honestly think this uh, Daniel Bryan was made by... Uh, this Brian Danielson, I believe it was made by a 2K employee because when I pre-ordered it and got early access, he was the only character that was made. So I am pretty sure this Brian Danielson was made by a 2K employee. Because like it was like up before anyone else. So this actually is Brian Danielson. If it, if fun, fun fact is the first creative one. Probably by those game changers who make those calls. Possibility. I see that, but if I got banned from the arena now. <laughs> All right, double C in a bit. Looks pretty good. Yeah. It, it might have just been er early access, but it is the first one. It is the first one. Dude, I, Mike Tyson with that uppercut. Oh, that animation is hot. Oh, uh, here comes Matthew K. Matthew K, fighting champion. Matthew, Matthew K always be here trying to fucking win some goddamn titles here. You know, he went from rookie to fucking star attraction pretty quick. I can't tell if you love or hate your bronze attire. Uh, I don't know. I feel like I don't like bronze attire because I feel like everyone in pro wrestling Noah wears that style of bronze attire. Like everyone just comes out with like fucking rainbow paint everywhere. I was like, all right, man. <laughs> 2K could probably be all the XWB guys in AW back in a sneaky call way. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. And Andy Paps is the last one out. Andy Paps. Uh, Andy Paps is like the Wayne Gretzky, Michael Jordan of this year's Cocoa Sports stream. You know who we haven't seen in a while? Good old Cody Rhodes. Where the fuck has Cody been? Cody won the title, had the title for six months, and, like, never has matches. 36 Twitch title reigns? Well, mate, you're about to make it 37. About to make it 37. <laughs> I have a Cody theory? All right, what's your Cody theory, sir? Lay it, up, lay it on us. Brian Daniel. Coco, do you think Anoki's WF title should be recognized? I think they should. Ah, uh, Yeah. Uh, I think any title raid should be recognized. And I think um, they either should combine the title. I think a lot of titles should be combined and they should recognize all the champs. Just combine all the titles. I think once he wins the title, he's going to turn heel and into Homelander from the boys where he was a heel, but he thinks he's a hero. Uh, I think that's what he wanted to do in AEW. I, I read somewhere on the internet machine that's what he wanted to do in AEW. So maybe he's just going to do it on a WWE stage. But yeah, I think that was his plan in AEW. And then he's just like, ah, fuck it. Back to the Fed I go. Cody in, is in WWE. He can't be the devil on AEW. Why not? He could be a very interesting character if he does. No, uh, I don't, we're not talking about the devil. We're talking about Cody and WWE. The devil's probably uh, Jack Perry because I keep using glass. But either way, I'm having fun with it. He thinks he's a hero, but he does heal moves. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Here comes Andy Pap. Oh, you said Cody was the devil? Got it. I don't know, dude. If, if CM Punk was the devil and worked for both companies or Cody did it, that would be fucking tremendous. But it's probably Adam Cole or Jack Perry, but it'll probably be Jack Perry. Do -do -do. CM Punk was probably the original idea. Uh, I don't think CM Punk was the original idea. Uh, I think they were hoping CM Punk would have gone back to WWE, so people would speculate that it's CM Punk. That's my theory. I have no facts whatsoever. That's just a Coco theory. Just a Coco theory. But yeah, I'm a big fan of Anoki. Uh, I, I have a bunch of Anoki stuff. Plot twist, the devil's Britt Baker. I mean, I guess. Could be leading away. And they really want to shock people till February and have Okada be the devil? That'd be nice. I, I was also thinking uh, maybe it's, uh, what's his name? Dolph Ziggler. 
Sam Besser partying. Shit, I hope it's Ric Flair like he, he was the Black Scorpion. <laughs> Sam, get ready for some 1v1 action, you son of a bitch. Hey, Vancouver, like the third or fourth best team in the league right now? What if it's Hogan? Oh my god, everyone would hate it. And that's just watching the world burn. Let's go go by. I already bought the season two pass. I don't think it's worth it. I only bought it for the content creation and to do to know what I was talking about. Brian Danielson has been eliminated. But uh yeah. What if four people are the devil? Uh we're like seventh. It's wherever the devil's Vince Russo. Sixth in point percentage, got it. There we go. Yeah, I already bought season two. I bought it to A, know what I was talking about. B, I like the AEW game. C, it's not worth it. Vince Russo is actually the devil. Yeah. Oh, man. I, I think it's so funny. I find it funny. I think maybe Hollywood's going this way, especially with Marvel movies. I find it funny that... People are hiring people to be creative and run it that actually hate the product. I, I I just find that to be fucking hilarious. Imagine it's Cornette. Toronto and oh dude. I don't know. I don't know. I don't I don't know if I want to deal with Cornette. <laughs> Toronto and LA are ahead of us behind the games in hand. Got it. I feel like the state of Kentucky would be engulfed in a blister explosion if it was Vince Russo. Yeah. Dark Metal Fan! What's going on, buddy? I need some help on Stream Raiders. How you doing, my friends? How's the life of someone as sexy as you? How, how, how is the life of someone as famous and popular as you? I love you, brother. I miss you. What if it's the uh, former members of the Pinnacle as the Devils? That kind of makes sense. I don't, I don't remember who they are, but God, it would make sense. Long term storytelling. The only way to see Cordette at AW is manage FTR, but that's also not happening. Oh, best pick for the devil. Hulk Hogan, Jim Cornette, Vince Russo, Dave Coco. Oh, this is tough. This is tough. You know, fuck. <laughs> uh, I'm not. Uh, the weather forecast said that there would be three inches of snow last night, but when I woke up in the morning, there was miles of it. Really? Oh, I get it. It's a fucking dad joke. I was like, why the fuck is Ireland in our snow? I get it. I get it. You fucking son of a bitch. <laughs> I voted for you. I voted for me too. It's definitely Dave Coco. I'm a Jim Cornette guy. Yeah, but the problem being a Jim Cornette guy is he had power and never changed. The reason why I hate v Russo, Jim Ross, and Cornette is... What they say on their podcast, they had the power to change and didn't. So it's like, like here, example, I ran wrestling. I hate non-title matches. I booked zero non-title matches and 10,000 matches. I hate contract signings. There was never a contract signing when I booked it. It's just, I don't know. They they have no standards. The real subs cry me, <laughs> the real subs cry me a river. Because wherever it's the entire time, it's him. What's up, T-Cage? Can't play Hurricanes cape in the house. BTS, when like Cornette is going through a history that he lived through, he should just be a story and enjoy listening to him. And my thing is, it's, 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 it's a historian, but he leaves out the parts where he fucked up. He leaves out the parts where shit went wrong. Do a contract signing backstage in an office. Yeah. The fucking contract signings are so dumb. But yeah, I don't know. I, I just... The, the problem with Jim Cornette is he had power and he didn't. And Vince doesn't? Uh, What about Vince McMahon? Vince doesn't have a podcast though. Are, are you talking about... Are you talking about Vince Russo? Uh, Vince Russo, no. He... he he just fucking despises pro wrestling. I don't like hijack sizes because they end up the exact same way. Well, no, it's it's a universe building. Because here's the thing. All right, let's just take an example, and I could give you thousands. You all love when um, he went, 
go one on one with the Undertaker. You all cheered. Why would you ever go one on one with the Undertaker? Like, there's no contract. I ain't signing that. It makes no sense. It destroys the whole universe. This man on a podcast would be hilarious. Yeah, a Vince McMahon podcast be hilarious now. I don't like contract signings, but they end up exact same way. Uh, Vince McMahon podcast would burn Twitter down. It really does. It'd be in a tag team match, play a play. <laughs> Vince, yeah, Vince has been on the podcast. He's been on Pat McCaffrey's and Stone Cold's. So. But I don't think he's had his own podcast. I don't think he would ever would. Don't, don't talk about Teddy Long. We met back. He was chill. I like Teddy Long. I'm not bad mouthing Teddy Long. I'm bad mouthing con contract signings. Yeah, like Teddy Long is great, but in the if contract signings are real, why would there ever be one on one with the Undertaker player? Why would there ever be? Like, it makes no sense in the universe. Wrestling weddings are all the same, right? Yeah, this man on my read the funniest book ever. I'm saying his own podcast. I never liked that thing. Do 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 do. Like contract signings don't make sense in in a wrestling universe. It it's a universe of breaker. Cause if you're a heel champ like the Miz, just never sign a contract. <laughs> it was like, uh, you're gonna fight John Cena at WrestleMania. The fuck I am. It makes no sense. Alright, uh, right now, Matthew K has the most energy. Adam Cole is still in there. Mike Tyson still in there. They were one. Miz is great. I love Miz. Miz is one of the few WWE guys I'd grab if I was starting my own company. Andy Paps has been eliminated by Mike Tyson. Adam Cole has been eliminated by Matthew K. So, two, uh, two, uh... Two, uh, the four, the, there's going to be a new champ. And that is Vince Russo and Dave Coco tied. Miss seems like a bro IRL. There you go. There you go. Coco plays. <laughs> How did Coco plays comment? It's either Barefoot or Sid's Light is commenting in our chat as me. Coco plays says, ah! <laughs> Fuck you, Mike Tyson. A lot of things don't make sense in wrestling. Why do people rush to join the Royal Rumble? I did my time and walk real slow. It's true, but that's like a choice. And also, uh, it would be the same as um, the All-Star game, running out of the tunnel. Like, that's more of a choice. But yeah, a lot of stuff don't make sense in wrestling. But I think contract signings are top of the cake. I was doing that channel, lurked, but I did it nice. I watched AEW again tonight. Seriously, it may as well be WWE. Uh, they're very close and similar. I, th I think uh, I think WWE has more promos and AEW has more wrestling. But they're so close. It's so weird that people cry and fucking defend so uh, religiously. Yeah, like it, it's it's close. Hey, what's up, Desert Rat? All right, we're down to the final three. Braun Breaker, Matthew K, Mike Tyson. Could this be an all Mike Tyson stream? Can we get Mike Tyson on skate for the NHL? I remember when Jim Ross uh, buried Bart Gunn after winning the Brawl for All. Again, Butter being at WrestleMania 15 for beating Dr. Death, Steve Williams. Mind you, Bart told Ross he would job to Dr. D. Yeah. Sam Besser. Yeah, that brawl for all, they did a shoot, and then they were pissed that the shoot didn't fix their story. Uh-oh, Matthew K might be in trouble. All right, all chatters are gone. It's Mike Tyson to go or Braun Breaker. Braun Breaker, I don't think he's ever won a title. I don't know if Mike... Oh, Mike Tyson has. Fuck Dr. Death? What did Dr. Death ever do to you? I don't know anything Dr. Death did bad. Ugh. <laughs> My favorite thing is Rocky shit. Is it Rocky? Sh Rocky three. Paulie. He's like, I don't like these people. They don't like you. What did they ever do to me? 
The story with Luke Cow is told? Oh, really? I don't know it. I apologize. Dr. Death killed his father? Is this fucking source chat? I don't know. I apologize. I don't know the story behind it. It's almost like anything could happen in a shoot fight. They should work for Brawl for all. There you go. Got it. Sid's Light's got a dancing raccoon. Gotta show him some love. There we go, boys. I gotta get some new emotes up there. Oh, shit! Is, dude, is this all gonna be Mike Tyson? Is this gonna be Mike Tyson's day? Boys, Mike Tyson, go at wrestling, boxing, and MMA. The Dark Side episode of Brawl 4 is all-time classic. I'll have to check it out. I didn't even see it. So close to give us a smooch real quick. Uh, what are you talking about, Vibrant Guide? The right man won. Mike Tyson. Do -do -do -do. I have not been having feelings towards the man and wrestler. It's a story. <laughs> Dark Side episode of Brawl 4. All basically the Russo versus Cornette round 4, 4 405. And go at it forever. Do, 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 do. Guys, why, why, why did this chat get horny? <laughs> I have no idea. Chat gets horny every now and then. Calm down, chat. Do. I just want to fit in? Yeah, tell me about it. Uh, all right. Loser in Japan match. The loser will get deleted. Here we go. All right. I will show it. Oh, we get. Yeah, maybe we should save it for Turkey Mania. That's not bad. The mat is sacred because Mike Tyson is the ring general. All right. What do we got here? Let's do a normal match. We'll go 10 minutes. And someone is going to be deleted. We'll even have knockouts on. 10 minute time limit. VC1601, welcome to the Internet Infantry. I'm a retired loser in Japan who streams sports, wrestling games every day for December, but then I'm moving to Friday nights in January with a Donner City Raptor Man. Give this stream two weeks. If you don't like it in two weeks, I'll be mad enough to say give us two more weeks. Do you have a favorite sport? Favorite wrestler, favorite pizza topic, tell us something about yourself. And remember, the internet infantry is for life. There you go. So yeah, I mean, speaking of Gunther, uh, has he been booked recently? Uh, I think he's okay. I don't know. I only watch the pay-per-views. How you doing, v v VCE? I'll say Vice, 1601, maybe. There we go. There we go. Speaking of pizza topping, I had pepperoni pizza for dinner. Nice. I mean, Coco Dream. Uh, pay-per-view will do, uh, pay-per-view will be having, uh, Friday night. So I saw the recent turn. Did, are you really? I, I want to see it. I'm probably going to watch it tonight. Is it good? I want to see it so bad, but I haven't. All right. So we got to decide who is getting deleted. These are our choices. All right. I'm going slowly. And you tell me, who do you think should be deleted? Dream will probably be deleted until he checks back in. Uh, great Kali. Should we get th that? Great Kali. I say Johnny Canuck versus Dream. Well, Dream's just probably going to be deleted. Delete Coco, Dave Coco. If you like surprise, you'll like this. What's that? Uh, great Kali is in a loser in Japan match. There we go. Let's go. Whoop. Ishi, Tiger Mask, Teal Shark, Swerve, Sting, the Shredder. We have never you on the Shredder. Should we go great Kali for a Shredder? Winner gets deleted. Uh, loser gets deleted. Oh, Spider Verse? Yeah, Spider Verse is awesome. If you like Spider Verse, you'll like this. Oh, really? That's cool. There you go. All right. Great Kali Shredder. I right, Great Kali Shredder. Losers being deleted. One of these sons of bitches being deleted. All right, here we go. Making sure. Loser in Japan match. Loser is gone forever. They're leaving the Coco Sports Dream World. We're going to find out who is going to be deleted. And after this, we'll have a YouTube Battle Royal. 
Uh, let me see. 13 King Style says Bret Hart, uh, sorry, Bart Gunn WWE career was killed. He was supposed to face Stone Cold if he won the tournament. Damn. God, it should be done every stream. Loser leaves the island. Yep. Well, we call it loser in Japan matches, but yep. Loser leaves the island. Oh my god, great color. Otherwise known as the great waste of space. Uh, Yeet used to come here a lot and loved him. He, he, but you know what? Yeet, you're not here. Yeah, Spider-Verse movie of the year, in my opinion. I loved it. I loved it. I can't think of a better movie that I watched. Um, I don't know. Me, me and my wife, we missed the movies, but Ant-Man was such a bad movie, we took a break. Yeet is a turkey ass. Yeah, he's a turkey. It happens, though. I was a streamer. People come, people go, people come back. It's just like a bar. He shows up for NCAA football. Sometimes. I, I thought about doing NCAA football today, but I was like, I'm running late. I love Spider-Verse. I love Spider-Verse, too. All I have to do is l nail the landing. Spider-Verse is probably, probably my favorite movie of the year. I still haven't seen Godzilla. I still haven't seen Ninja Turtles. But Ant-Man sucked balls. Like, I, 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 it broke me. Like, everyone's talking about the Marvels. I'm like, dude, I didn't even give the Marvels a shot after Ant-Man. Minus one was amazing. Yeah. Life takes over, unfortunately. I know. Uh, but not only that, but it's also, too, like, not everyone's locked inside. And second, I still, one of my favorite streamer jokes of all time, I want to put on a shirt. Your success ruins my streams. Oh, did you get a new girlfriend? Bam, you ruined my streams. Oh, did you get a new job? Bam, you ruined my stream. Your success ruins my streams. I'm seeing Godzilla this weekend. Awesome. Tomorrow's a dumpster fire. Yeah. They're trying to fix everything, but it might be too late. Oh, the Marvels. I haven't seen it. Keep the wizard out of your fucking mouth. Yeah, we lost that guy. We lost. I, I'm pretty sure that guy's still a loser. Disney's a dumpster fire. They, man, they're hurting bad. They're hurting bad. But that's what happens when you listen to a bunch of IP jackers. I want to make a story about a fucking loser in Japan, but no one will buy that, so I'll make Batman a loser in Japan. I feel like Black Cat is uh, one of Marvel's most underrated characters. I'm worried about any female character movie. Uh, my thing is, if I wouldn't mind seeing a new Spider-Man, Black Cat be the, in the movie as the main ca uh, one of the main characters. I don't know. I would paint her as a villain and face, but Black Cat stories with Spider-Man are pretty amazing. And the way Spider-Man left off the MCU. Black Cat being there because MJ isn't makes so much sense. Go woke, go broke. I, uh, not necessarily. Go woke, go broke on an IP that doesn't deserve it. Yes. Like, here's the thing. You can go woke on Barbie. It's going to work. You can go woke on certain stuff, but that you can't make something. You can't make the Punisher go woke. You can make, I don't know, uh... Strawberry Shortcake go woke. You can make certain things go woke. But, like, there are certain characters that are like, yeah, that's not the IP. I could imagine that the Marvels uh, tanked. I, oh, it did. It's the worst movie in Marvel cinematic history. I still try to drop my people's street. I, can. I appreciate it, Dark Metal fan. Batman in Japan? They actually did that for a one-off. Speaking of the Wizards, they're relocated North Virginia with the Capitals. Uh-oh. Are they still going to be called Washington? Has anyone found the VOD yet? No. The re-event of the Capital One. AJ, they're moving. It's official. I don't know. I saw something on Twitter they're moving, but I don't know if that makes it official. Source Twitter. The PS5 Spider-Man 2 is awesome. I seen Spider-Man 1. I saw a Let's Play of it. I thought it was amazing. I haven't seen Spider-Man 2. I don't play games like that, but I, that might be the one I do play. I love Black Hat movie, but not yet. Um, A solo movie I don't think would work. I think her being in the Spider-Verse... Uh, uh, the, the Marvel one would make sense timing wise I thought the word uh, the word was they were invested 600 million in uh, renovations you can go woke as long as it makes sense yeah exactly woke's all my blood relying on being woke is yes is it build a new arena uh, land at owner's own yeah they'll still be in Washington blade goes woke woke equals 90% bad uh I don't know it's it's hard to tell but it has to make sense for the character. Go watch Turtles to do some woke switches, but it makes sense when you do it. Good examples. I'm getting Spider-Man 2 for a Christmas. Nice. Dude, why is the great creative city destroying Shredder and HP is so much higher? Dude, 
none of that shit matters, Rex. <laughs> like, as someone that's watched it and been a part of a thousand, yeah. They're moving away from the river from DC. The Red Skull goes woke. Uh, on YouTube, 13th, uh, I'm trying to catch up on all the chat. Thank you so much for chatting so much. 13th uh, King Style uh, on YouTube says, yeah, Ant-Man, one of the, uh, one for me was one of the worst superhero movies I ever watched. Not because it was so bad, it was because it was so boring and super slow as superhero movie. Uh, uh, yeah, not only that, but like, if you like Kang the Conqueror, it makes no sense. That I, I don't want to give spoilers, but don't watch it. The Red Skull goes woke. <laughs> Did anyone ever find a Wizards guy bot? No. Not anymore. One of my favorite lines from Ninja Turtles. Okay, I know that uh, that's objectively pre prejudice, but that's what dad taught us. <laughs> Whoever finds a Wizards guy gets a free sub. Hell yeah. Kali off the top rope. Kali's gone nuts. This ends in a draw. Both guys are fired. Yes, sir. It's great Kali and Shredder. I'm going to go get a soda real quick. Whoop. There we are. I think it was Leo anyway. Yeah, Leo destroys. Uh, shoehorning in woke stuff in movies shows destroy them. It's organic progression. Fine. Yeah, I kind of agree with that. It just has to make sense. But it, what you have to stop is IP jackers. You have to stop the, I don't like Thor, but I'm making a Thor movie. That's what you have to stop. You know, like, if, if, if it's not your IP, you should respect it. And I think if Hollywood learns that lesson, they'll be a lot more successful and turn it around. If you want a female Indiana Jones... Don't put Indiana Jones in it and just have a female version. I have this great idea for a comic series. The young adult generally all did karate cows. <laughs> yep. Indiana Jane. Oh, man. If Tony Stark would turn, out, uh, turn black, I'd be okay with it. Uh, I mean, you gotta look, um, what's his name? Shit, Samuel Jackson. Shit, what the fuck, uh, Nick Cage. Is it Nick Cage? No. What the fuck is Samuel Jackson's fucking character? He was a white guy. Nick Fury, that's it. Nick Fury, Nick Fury was a white guy and he turned black and no one gave a shit. One of my favorite lines in Turtles, Ninjas kicked the damn rabbit. Uh-oh, I haven't seen it yet. Uh-oh, Shredder's in trouble here, boys. Like, definitely not Steve Rogers. I love Samuel L. Jackson. Yeah. Oh, the Great Cully wins! He's staying! The Great Cully wins by countout! Shredder is bleeded! Oh, damn you. Gotta win by countout. He's gonna stay forever. He's gonna stay forever! <laughs> uh, Disney pulls a WWE and just hate create something for the sake of it because they can do anything else that's bad. It's almost like they took the playbook out of WWE. Oh yeah, they go back and said, I really don't like Marvel. No, nah, well the thing is, they they're they're they wanted they wanna change the world by being creative, but they're not creative enough to do it, so they have to steal someone else's IP. Black Nick Fury is the white Nick Fury's son? <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. I, I don't know the, I don't know the, I don't know the, the, the actual lore of it. Mario Brothers did it right. Mario Brothers is fucking up there. Mario Brothers and Spider-Verse. I'd, I'd put a point up there. And I know it's late, but I finally caught up on, uh, me and, me and my girl finished, uh, what the hell's that movie called? Uh, TV show? The Last of Us. We saw The Last of Us. The Last of Us is kind of weird because uh, me, me and my girl are big fans of that show. And that's woke, woke stuff done right and woke stuff done wrong in the same exact episode. Alright? So everyone's mad that there's a, a gay couple. But that episode fucking rocks. 
And then the next episode, they have random fucking woman who's tough. It is the worst fucking episode ever. So, it's almost like the story matters. Like, everyone's like, oh, there's two gay guys in fucking The Last of Us. Boo-hoo-hoo. But that episode fucking kicks ass. And then there's some random fucking woman that's like, oh, if I was in this room, I was safe. Meh. I'm the leader of the military. Meh. Oh, she was the fucking worst. Oh, I just wanted to watch The Brothers. HBO Max, yeah. Uh, the show's pretty good. Finally, they made the woke ass shit. Yeah, Mario's my second favorite movie of the year. Yeah. He is? It's canon? I did not know. Raise it is. Is it being creative? No. No, it is not. The show is really good. I, I like it. There's one character that will piss you to fuck off because you want to hear the brother stories. Like, there's two brothers in the game and you want to hear their stories. And they go to this random fucking white woman that serves no purpose at all. Like, I have no idea why she's in the movie. At all. At all. It fucking... And, and the thing is, they can't put everything in a TV show. And every time they skip the scene, we're like, they had that stupid-ass white woman. They had that stupid-ass white woman. Oh, she was the worst. Oh, she was the worst. <laughs> Just the worst. Uh... do 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 the two gay guys were, uh, bag ass, but, uh, it shouldn't be there. Ellie's a lesbian. Is canon? No. Yeah, that's canon. All right, moving on. But no, there's a white woman in, like, the episode after the gay dudes. Holy shit, she's the fucking worst. Like, they give her so much screen time and no one fucking cares. I don't know. Was she, like, banging a director? I have no idea why she exists. All right, boys, I'm just gonna put this dinosaur here. So if you could, I, I need some assists, but I don't know how to get the assists. I just know how to score. Know how to score and dunk. Alright, here we go. Let's collect. Got some snowflakes there, boys. You're white woman that bangs directors every day. Maybe. Like, if someone said that woman banged a director, I'd be like, okay. Because outside of the director getting sex, she serves no purpose in life. She was the fucking worst. Just the worst. Uh, hey, Dave, do you watch K-dramas? A little bit. Have you seen Squid Games and uh, Bargain? They're so good. Yeah, I've seen them. I think Squid Games peaked at the Marble game. Uh, yeah, Squid Games is pretty fucking awesome. Do -do -do -do. I, I, I tell you this, though. Koreans... They know how to fucking tell a story. They understand story structure. Dude, I watch Subway ads in Korea that are a million times better than anything Hollywood's making. I'm just like, dude, I'm like fucking tearing up and shit. And they're like, eat fresh Subway. <laughs> what the fuck, Korea? What the fuck? Yeah, Korea is a crazy guy at telling stories. All right, Shredder has been deleted. Shredder. Deleted! Delete just like the content only images used the content won't be deleted. Delete both this like the content images used in it. So we use it. Uh, I don't know. I, I I might have fucked this up. Kinda happened in the game, allowed Joel to meet black guy and, and brother. Does it? Yeah. The white Nick Fury. I never saw squ uh, squ uh, Squid Games, but heard nothing but love for it. It's pretty good. I kinda I kinda worry about the next season, where they go with it. Because if they follow the main character in season two, I'm just not going to watch. Like, they have to do something cooler. All right. Let's go custom female. We got this next. Oh, we're going to do YouTube. So, after, this is after the YouTube. All right. Some of these women are dying. Who is it going to be? Actually, we don't. Never mind. We don't have enough women. All these women are kind of important. Nah, we just got too many dudes. All right, women, you keep your fucking job. Dudes, you guys are, are, go are going to be fucking leaving soon, dudes. One of you guys are going to be leaving. All right. We can go Shark Boy. Shark Boy's not used that much. Shark Boy. I'm trying to see who doesn't get used much. Oh, Johnny Canuck. Johnny Canuck. Doesn't get used that much. 
All right, so Johnny Canuck. Shark Boy stays. Brody can go. Hey, what's up, Wolf Knight? We're trying to delete some people. Feels good, man. God damn it. Nick's lost 117, 113. No. I find Chelsea. Does. I can finally get. Yeah, most likely. We're going to try to delete setting. Got to have it again. They uh, check tweets. Don't have to show. All right. Give me a second. Boop, boop. Delete. 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 Ah, uh, there you go. All right, all right, cool, 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 cool. All right, let me see. Here we go, boys. All right, let's do the YouTube, and then we'll do the men loser in Japan match. Uh, we are going to do the YouTube title. YouTube, you get YouTube. I uh, put your guys in because you're gonna get first, first go at this. Oh, there we go. Battle Royal. There we are. All right. Who's the YouTube champ right now? S Sam Besser. He's also the top champ. So there you go. All right. And let me see. YouTube, you can get it. All right, dude, YouTube. I, I will fucking punch you in the dick, YouTube. I don't understand how YouTube chat works. I touch it and they're like... Blah, 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 blah. Matthew K, Kenny Omega. All right, we'll get him in. Yeah, man, uh, really sucked. Yeah. Hey, Dave, do you watch K dramas? Yes. A Korean RoboCop Robin commercial. <laughs> yeah. I'll go follows a little bit to figure out season one. I think they should do more front man and brother of police. I don't think so. I honestly think season two. If I was doing Squid Game, season two would be uh, the guys in masks. I do not find. I do not find what's the next step interesting at all. I wish they didn't tell us what the next step was. I would love for it to be at a season two to be exactly the same time as season one, except you get to follow the guys in masks and see how their job is. That would be me. Now, a prequel would be awesome, too. I wouldn't mind a prequel. Brian Daniel said, all right. All right, let's see. We're going to YouTube first. So we got Matthew K. Feel free. Well, let's get Masawa too. Masawa got fucked last time. Let's get Masawa out there. Whoops, that Masawa. There we go. Masawa, yeah! Um, Kenny Omega. There will be a more chances for Twitch, but we're, we're going YouTube first. This is a YouTube title. Hey, what's up, Zipping Spider? Brian Danielson. All right, there we go. And after, after it, it slows down. Sam suit, please. You got it, boss. Sam wants to get dressed up for your YouTube title. So like different segment on the main story. Yeah, different segment on the main story. Chris Jericho. All right, we'll go Chris Jericho, and we're going back to uh, Twitch after this. Do -do 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 -do. All right, Twitch, we're coming to you. Brody Lee can go. Johnny Canuck versus Dream. Maybe Jake Lee. Do I have Jake Lee? I had Jake Lee. Do I still have Jake Lee? I do. And people say, I hate Jake Lee. Delete Dream and Brody. Will do. Delete Jeff Jarrett. We'll have to put him in a match. Jeff can go. Don't delete Double, double J with it. Turkey Ash Dream, Brody, Shark Boy, and Johnny can all get deleted. Well, we got to do 1v1 matches. Jeff versus Kurt before we delete uh, Jeff. All right. Put me in a suit, please. Got it. Andy Paps wants his rematch. All right. Let's get Andy Paps in there. Confirmed. I say Brody Lee stays. So why do you hate Jake Lee again? Uh, oh! G-Man headed back to the UK. G-Man and Noah. All right, Ninja Mac. You got to get Ninja Mac. You know we got Ninja Mac, dude. You know I love Ninja Mac more than a straight man should. My Japanese friends call me the fake Ninja Mac. <laughs> Let's go. I want in, white, Andy Paps wants in. Oh, Domo! We missed you, buddy. We missed you, all right. Jericho's being dumped for Domo, because Domo's not here all the time. All right, sorry, Jericho. We love you, but we gotta get Domo in. We got, how about, there's the YouTube belt, only people on YouTube get to pick wrestlers. Ah, uh, when it picks up, we will. You forgot me, I said Matthew K. Son of a bitch, Matthew K. Where are we gonna go? We got him, who are we gonna eliminate? I'm about to make a fucking Royal Rumble. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Well, he has to be. He has to be. Oh, shit. 
Andy Paps, you might be getting fucked here, buddy. Or it might be Brian Danielson. I I thought I put in Matthew K. Do we have to do two YouTubes? Dumbo, thanks. I'm on YouTube, OG. All right, who, who are we going to get rid of? Kenny, Brian Danielson. These are what I'm leaning towards. I'm leaning towards one of these two. Do -do -do. Sam has to be there. Fine, give me the winner. 1v1. All right, we'll get the winner. 1v1. He sacrificed and he scammed in. Let's get Matthew K. Whoops. No, who was this? No, who was it? Who was it? Oh, it was Domo. <laughs> I had to see there was a delay. I had to see there's a delay on the other screen. I panicked. All right, Andy Pab saves us and fucking sucks. That was Domo. Like, no, I panicked. All right, and let's see. Get Matthew K in here. Matthew K. I said Matthew K's name, but I never read it. Andy Paps fucks us, but got it. Bye, Kenny. Nope, Kenny's staying. Kenny's staying. All right, title on. Sam Besser, winner. Doing six epic legendaries. They're headed to bed. Hey, have a good one. and Appreciate it, Dark Metal fan. There we go. All right, boys. That was, that was that was a little stressful. I, I gotta get like the YouTube and the Twitch to combine chats. Any packs fuck smell demanding a 1v1. Update, you have Pringles? Nice. Oh. I know I, I actually I think it, his odds are improved. Hey um G Man. I uh, have a happy holidays in the UK. Can't wait for you to come back, sir. We'll have to hang out, eat some burgers, and high five soon. I'm going to try to go to more and more events. <laughs> oh, schnooky. There we are. He said you saved them and fuck yourself. <laughs> there we go. We got this, boys. This is for the YouTube title. And then we also have some more belated matches coming. Some more belated matches on our way. I said I saved you guys and fucked you guys at the same time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He saved us and fucked the gang. You know, Andy Paps like, I'll do the honor. Agree or disagree? Charles Barney's the greatest NBA player to never win a championship. I'm going to say yes off the top of my head, but I'm trying to think there's probably others. Yeah, he's goddamn good. He's really good. If Andy Paps do a woman, uh, then I won't cash in. Harry Rex is like, I won't cash in. I mean, you could cash in and make it a three-way, but then we're going to put a timer in. We learned that yesterday. We learned that yesterday. <laughs> Those three ways, those triple threats could take forever. Yeah, but then Andy will fire me. <laughs> Never! One, two, three, Blue Panda. We need you, buddy. We need you. Keep kicking that ass. Also, G-Man, uh, just like Masawa, works for Noah. Rest in peace, uh, Masawa, not G-Man. So does Jake Lee and Ninja Mac. And you can watch Noah on... Wrestle Universe! Uh, hashtag not an ad. Hashtag obviously, but it's got some of the best shit going. Even though... Holy fuck, man. Evil? Really? Was this your idea, G-Man? Uh, who was eliminated? I think Jake Lee was just eliminated. Jake Lee has been eliminated. I run T T and a here. I run Team TNA here. Tobo. He's like, oh -oh. This Friday pay-per-view, Turkey Mania. You'll join me in what? Professional wrestling? Because I'm, I'm going to the 20th. Boop, 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 boop. Ah, here we go. Oh, join Andy Paps. Got it. Yeah, we, we're making it where that doesn't happen next year because it makes the most boring fucking storylines ever. Ah, oh, there we go. 
Oh, Schnooky. Hmm. I'll join Andy Paps. <laughs> what an original storyline. I bet you that's not happening in any other EFED. <laughs> it's never happened. Not once. We can be buddies, <laughs> but not factions. Teammates. Yeah, you can be buddies, but not teammates. But next year, we're changing it. So it has to be on team chatters, right? Oh, yeah. Well, that that's a one match only. You're going to have team chatters versus team streamers. That's uh, pay-per-view. Meanwhile, the Golden Star Lovers just sit back and play video games together. Heck, yeah. You had a good, for the first time ever, Golden Star Lovers ended this show on top. Matthew K is fighting Masao with all his heart. There we are. Oh, Schnooky. Will Sam be able to get... By the way, um, the challenger has been really sick. Dark Spectre has not been feeling well. So hopefully, hopefully uh, Dark Spectre bounces back. Check the poll. Best NBA power forward. Carl Malone, Charles Barkley, Kevin Garnett, Dennis Rodman, Sean Kemp. Well, Dennis Rodman is the best at uh, is the best at rebounding. Sean Kemp uh, was the best at dunking, but towards the end of his career, kind of. I'm going to go Charles Barkley. Uh, Carl Malone's not that bad, but uh, then Kevin Garnett. Kevin Garnett's a good choice. Kevin Garnett's a good choice. I'm going Charles Barkley. Go, I just broke the streamer. H-I-P-A. What is that? I have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. Do 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 do. I want Kevin Garnett. I have a massive bag crush on him. Nice. He's awesome. Kevin Garnett is one of the best. Oh Jesus. Do do do. Ninja Mac got it going. So far, Jake Lee's the only one out. Maybe I do hate Jake Lee. Dude, I got these pants, and they're like a little too tight. And I already fucking uh, ripped a hole in them. And here's the thing. I'm pretty sure these ain't my pants. I think these are Bear Friend's pants. Bear Friend didn't do laundry, so I wore Bear Friend's pants. And uh, I ripped them. Kenny Omega is gone. Matthew K called his shot. You're a doctor, broke law, tell you about someone's health. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, tight spot. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. There we are. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ninja Mac. Do -do -do. Oh, okay. I was like, I don't know. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. There we go. Ninja Mac on. Oh, no. Ninja Mac isn't gone. Who was eliminated? I'm a ninjanist. Domo eliminated two people. Domo's on fire. Oh, it's Kenny is gone. There you go. Mm-mm-mm. We also have some more elimination matches coming. We'll be how about Jeff Jarrett versus Shark Boy? Loser gets eliminated. <laughs> One more tweet, don't have to show. This is you. Yeah, yeah. I wore Bear Friend sweats and now there's just a giant hole. <laughs> no one tell Bear Friend. Now here's my thing. Do I do I go? Got to keep double J. All right, we got to keep double J. We'll have to figure out who's in the next Lij match next. Who's gonna be deleted? We got to make room for others. Dream versus Shark Boy. Well, I think we're gonna delete Dream no matter what. He just hasn't been here. If he shows up, we'll delete someone for him. I don't think Dream's been here in like 200 years. We'll just have to re-download him if he shows up. <laughs> Yeah, maybe I'll, maybe we'll, let's just delete some of the guys, period. Get that out of the way. Make some room for the roster. Johnny Canuck. Oh, Johnny Canuck's got to battle someone versus Lokata. Shark Boy could just get eliminated. We go Johnny Canuck versus Shark Boy. I'm placing artillery. If someone could get a relatively high flag bearer, but it would be cool. All right, listen up, Stream Raider heads. Dark Metal Fan is placing artillery. If someone could put a relatively high flag bearer beside it, it would be cool. Look at Dark Metal Fan. He's got strategy. Now it shows up, tells him, get fired for being a turkey ass, period, yeah. 
You take my shitty flag bearer and like it. <laughs> Bear friend's pants are ripped. Alright, boys. I, I guess I guess I'm bigger than Bear Friend. <laughs> uh, now here's the question. I ripped her pants. Do I put it in the washer and dryer and be like, what the hell? The washer and dryer did it? Or I just throw it in the trash? What, what what's your call? You got lucky? Domo. Jets beating the Kings. Blame the washing machine? I think you're right. I think you're right. So, go. did you like what I did with the logo on your shirt? I saw it. It looked pretty fucking awesome, dude. Do you have a pet? Uh, we used to have a... Uh, oh. Masawa gets thrown out. Kicked over the top rope by Matthew K. We used to have a bird named Larry Bird. And he passed away maybe a year or two years ago. And it, when we move to a new house, we're going to get a dog. But as of now, we don't have a pet. Yeah, good old Larry Bird. What's on your shirt now? Uh, Keno? <laughs> Keno! Always remember and love you, Larry. Yeah. Did he pop up? I couldn't see. Uh, the Larry pop-ups are not working. Uh, so when Sid Light... We may have to retire that one, or... Maybe we'll have to make it a point command. But the, the way we do the pop-ups ain't working for Larry. Nah, I put that John Cena on your shirt for Dave Coco. Nice. Yeah, I saw. It's pretty badass, dude. Thank you. Got some more Dave Coco action. Tonight, and then uh, Friday night, going against John Cena. You can't blame it on the pet then. Oh, yeah. Nope, don't blame it on the pet. Oh, Ninja Mac has been eliminated. Matthew K is on fire. Matthew K wants this goddamn title. Oh, Domo sneaks up from behind. Domo, did they teach you that at the dojo? Did they teach you that at the dojo? Do do do. And there he goes. Hmm. Oh shit! Everyone battling like crazy. Last four. Uh, Brian Danielson, Sam Besser, Domo, and Matthew K. Sam Besser is the biggest champ in the tournament, but right now, only his YouTube doo doo. Oh, go, go. I need to upload D Domo. I don't have him anymore. Okay, I don't I don't know how to do that. So, we have Domo right here in ring, but I don't know if you made him. I think you did. I'm not sure. But we have a Domo. So, that means if Domo loses the LIJ match... If Domo loses an LIJ match, he might be gone forever. No, Domo! <laughs> Domo has been eliminated. Oh, Jesus. Right now, everything is coming up Matthew K, but he has to throw over the big guy over the top rope. We're down to the final three. Domo's like, what the hell? Matthew K is fighting his heart out, busted open, in control, but he has to get that big chicken man over the top rope. Pole, best NBA small forward. Scotty Pippen, Dave Coco, or Carmelo Anthony. Well, I don't think that's a choice. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go Scotty Pippen, but I'm sure there's better small forwards. Carmelo Anthony ain't too bad. After all those saves, Domo. You're down, you're down. Oh, Jesus. I voted for you? Thank you. Oh, it's so funny. Uh, I haven't played basketball in forever, but in Japan, I played in a minor league basketball league. And uh, I wasn't that good, but I had fun. But I haven't played basketball in a while. I went to an arcade, and it just felt weird shooting a ball. Oh, Jesus. Fuck you, chicken man. <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right. Uh-oh, here we go. Suplex. Damn. Mm. Oh, Jesus. I were down to the final three. If I was Brian Danielson and Matthew Cadd work as a team against Chicken Man, Chicken Man might, might fucking have it. 
Dude, if, if if Sam Besser wins this, Andy Paps gets a 1v1, and if Andy Paps beats him, oh my god, can you imagine all the shit Paps is gonna talk to Sam Besser? I love those arcade basketball machines. Me too. I was a bit off. Uh-oh. Daniel Bryan's gone. It's Matthew K or Sam Besser. Chatter on chatter action. Chatter on chatter action, boys. Who's going to win? Matthew K. Sam Besser, double champion. Has the biggest title in the world. So much. Sam might not be able to make it. No. Poor Sam Besser. I watched that movie? What movie is that? Poor Sam Besser? I don't know who you're talking about. There we go. HCA? <laughs> what does HCA stand for? Hot Chatter Action? <laughs> HCA. Sam Besser wins! Sam Besser wins. How am I going? I'm doing pretty good, my friend. How are you? Chatter on chatter action. Rigged. All right, Sam Besser, 1v1, Andy Paps for the YouTube title. Hardcore country, Americans. There we are. YouTube champ. Coco, turn on knockouts off, please. Turn knockouts off, please. All right, we'll turn knockouts off, but we're not going to turn off the timer. We'll go 15 minutes. Do you guys remember when the YouTube videos... Who's old enough to remember YouTube videos could only go 10 minutes and then only 15 minutes? Do you guys remember that? Hey, what's up, Dallas? I haven't seen you in 23,311 years. I remember. I do remember everyone was part one, part two, part three, part 56. Those were good days. Those were good days. <laughs> uh, what do we got here? What's the situation? The dark ages of YouTube? I kind of like the old school. Like, it was the wild, wild west. There wasn't as many rules. All right, here we go. Coco Sports. Is anyone cashing in? Is anyone cashing in? Oh, this is your chance to cash in if you're going to do it. You got Sam Besser. And Sam, you get the you, you can defend both titles if you want, but you know he's not. I mean, what the fuck we asking? Andy Paps. Pre-Google YouTube was wild. Oh yeah. I'm under <laughs> no YouTube at all. <laughs> yeah, me too. Or when you rate stars one through five, just not a thumbs up, thumbs down. Oh yeah. He will. I'm the hardcore champion gaming group on Facebook. You call me play WD. Oh, that's awesome, man. Oh, Alright. All right, what do we got here? Championship. Well, you know what? Let's put entrances on. Let's put entrances on. Hello, whoops. You want knockouts on or off, sir? Paps, I forget which one. Right when you get video response? Oh, those were the good old days. Those were the good old days. Off? All right. All right, you got 15 minutes. You got 15 minutes to prove yourself. Remember private messaging? Oh, yeah. I, I, dude, I, I forget that sometimes I fucking don't see my private messages. You always get, like, these fucking guys that are like, Oh, fucking, I'm gonna take you down. It's like, what? Five eggs place, one boy should rip this map. Hell yeah. And then when you go to sleep, we're gonna get destroyed. Are right, you gonna be a part of this? Just all you have to do with Dallas is be active. All you got to do is be active, sir. You're active. You're a part of it. If you come by every other Tuesday, you're not part of it. <laughs> That's just the way it works. All right. If I beat Sam, he'll never hear the end of it. Sam Besser. Andy Paps. 1v1 YouTube Championship. Remember friend request? I guess, I guess they still have that on uh, Facebook, right? Daddy Bass lose. You put up the code... Uh, and you put up Coco Bell. I accept the match. <laughs> Wolf Knight is live. All right. That's kind of douche, but all right. I have nothing against Wolf Knight, but <laughs> there's something as matters. Messi, I know you're new, but that's called the dick move. <laughs> Tell Wolf Knight I said hello. 
Guys, did you know Demon Rider, Problem Right, Problem HD, Terry O, Sportscast Squad, X24 Rocks, Alf, Jens Pulver, Can Wow, Grandpa and Uncle Grumpy, Muck Worm, Jugsy, all live right now? <laughs> Uh, you can still use manners. We support we support Wolf Light all the way, but we don't support dick moves. Remember video and oh my god, I forgot about those. That was a thing of nostalgia. I liked video annotations because like sometimes you'd misspeak, and it was like, hey dudes, there's a video annotation. I was wrong. And he paps. Stick. <laughs> Are you talking about the stuff that wide receivers used on their hands? All right, here comes Andy Paps. He's coming down. They are. Andy Paps, a king of kings. The website? No, I don't think I have. I, I thought you were talking about the stuff wide receivers put on their hands back in the day to make their fucking hands sticky. Thirty-five seconds left. There we are. Pokey catch. There, Sam, go Sam Besser. Let's see if we can make it. Sam Besser is the highest champ, but he's not. Wait, I'm alive. <laughs> That's why I'm chatting. <laughs> there we go. Stick AM. I don't know what the hell this is. Is that Wrestle AM? <laughs> Stick AM. It was the live stream. Oh, I no, I've never used this a day in my life. None of this look, none of this is hitting nostalgia at all. I don't think I've ever seen any of it. There we go. Uh oh. What? It, look at these guys. He's bringing the big belt down to fucking tease you. He's bringing the big belt down. TN Andy. TN Andy. TN Andy. Total non stop Andy Paps, baby. Oh, uh, he brought the big belt just to fucking tickle your balls a bit. Just tickle your balls. Yeah. Did you hear there was one of the Tom Brady uh, Tom Brady pulled from a baseball product? I don't know how he played baseball. I don't think I don't know if he ever played baseball in the pros, but I know he was drafted by the Montreal Expos. <laughs> That's for you, 13, uh, 13 King style. Alright, what well, uh oh, what what is what is he saying? He said something to the camera. He said stream Raiders is free to play with in-game purchases. Dude, we are gonna kick so much ass thanks to uh thanks to Dark's Dark Metal fan, but but we're gonna fucking get our ass kicked the next time because he's going to bed. So I need some of you guys to step up. I need some of you guys to step up. Here we go. Alright. Dark metal fan dropping all these epics. I got Hungleberries. We got some, we got some good shit here, boys. Dark metal fan, Hungleberry, okay, Boomer, one two three, Blue Panda, Big S, Big S. We need you to step up, Turtle Man, uh, Turtle Squad, Milkman. I'm hoping because like the last two days I've died on the thing. Don't know, don't know. Thank you, Messi. There we are. What do you think about Otani going to the LA Dodgers? It kind of makes the most sense, but it's pretty amazing what the salary cap and all that is. Um, a lot of people thought he was going to go to the Blue Jays. I don't know. Like, it's one of those things after it happened, you're like, oh, yeah, it's kind of obvious. You caught him? Pokemon. And when his subscribe button was yellow? Oh, yeah. Those were the good old days. Do -do 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 Fuck Otani's agent. Yeah, he he fucked Toronto. I I I felt like Toronto had a shot. A couple teams had a shot, but now that it's all said and done, it kind of makes sense that it was that. Okay, okay, Boomer. You now let's give Dark Metal fans some love, and let's give Okay, okay, Boomer some love. There you go, and let's keep battling, boys. Hopefully, we can get to. Two million a year for ten years. Yeah, and then he's gonna get it all at the end. He's also invading. He's uh, it's gonna help him in taxes. I right, hopefully we can make it across this map. One of our greatest warriors is going to bed. Look, that's Dark Metal fan right there, not past Larry Bird. Uh, he, he's our leader. He led us to victory. Now he's going to bed. 
We need to do it without him. We need to do it without him. That's what we need. All right. I need. I still need some assists. What? What? Uh. Wait. Yeah. Here we go. There we go. There we go. All right. We'll start here. Hopefully, I can get an assist and murders with this guy. That'd be fantastic, to be honest. All right, back to wrestling, boys. 1v1, YouTube title on the line. Andy Paps, Sam Bessers. Got it. If I win, I better get a title match. That's up to Sam or pay-per-view. You got to talk shit to Sam. You got to find a way to talk Sam into a 1v1 match. But he did bring down the title to rub it in your face. Look at that. He's got both titles. YouTube and the one that the Coco Sports title is the biggest title in professional wrestling events. Yeah, if he goes back to Japan, he won't have to pay California taxes. So he's going to get all his money at the end without having to pay California. That's up to you, White Ghetto. No, rules are rules, Andy Paps. We established the rules. If I, if I win, I'll put it up. You're gonna put up the you. You're gonna put up your main title against. Hold on, hold on. Is he just busting balls here? Are you gonna put your main title up against Andy Paps tonight? This will be the greatest fucking chat challenge in the history of fucking wrestling, ever. So be clear, I cannot cash in on Sam Best Big Title. No, you can only do it for uh, YouTube and Twitch titles. I want to kick, but but I'll kick anyone's butts. <laughs> all right, all right. All you got to do is be active, Dallas, and then we'll give you a spot. All right. We're actually deleting people for more spots. Look at him. He's got the YouTube title. Sam, Sam, I want you to be clear because Big and Banner Besties dropping a Larry Bird. Love to see it. Love to see it. Can I accept if Andy Paps loses? It's up to Sam. I think Sam is tickling the balls. A little bit of trolling here. I don't think he's going to fucking deliver. I want the, uh, you can cash in on the YouTube title if you have enough uh, Braden points. There's a cash in for the YouTube title. I don't know how long you've been watching. Ah, here goes 15 minutes. And in January, the prices are going to be dropping. Cat! Tight spot, tight spot. You busted my balls here! The match just started! Why didn't you cash in before the match? Alright, tight spot has a cash in. <laughs> the real tight spot cashes in late. He's gonna get the winner. Did I just hear that Andy Pass put up a title against Fallout Boy? Uh, I'm not wanting this title. Uh, what title do you want? There's no tag team. There's Twitch. You, there's Twitch women and men and a YouTube men's title. That's what we got. Alright. Uh, hey, uh, hey, Dave, what are you? This is from YouTube, 13th King style. Uh, hey, Dave, what are your thoughts on TNA and why do you think it went downhill? Uh, how are the people to blame? I, I don't think it's a TNA thing. I think it's an AEW New Japan thing. I think when it comes to pro wrestling, someone does something original and they get really close. Like, let's say Raptor Man is WWE. They get really close to WWE and then someone like Vince Russo... Eric Bischoff, Jim Ross, Taz. Someone goes, to get to beat WWE, you got to be just like WWE. And then they drop off. I think I think the same thing that happened to TNA happened to New Japan. I think the same thing that happened to New Japan might happen to AEW. You want the Twitch title? All right. Who's the Twitch champ? I didn't even fucking write that down. Chat. Who's the Twitch chat? I'm not wanting Twitch title. Twitch title, it's coming. All right, tight spot first, Twitch champ. Next, 1v1. The fly circle is decided, crash and burn. Well, because they always get bad advice. To beat WWE, you've got to sign all the former WWE guys. To beat WWE, you got to be just like WWE. It's Mike Tight. Tight spot versus Tyson? All right, tight spot versus Tyson. It's on next, boys. It's on next, cash-ins. TNA and Packers are safe? Yes. Yes, uh, just different time periods. They start off as TNA, they turn to Impact, and then they're going to change back to TNA. I personally like the TNA name better. I'm 600 points away from a cash in as well. Damn. Stone Cold versus Tyson. Oh, that was the clickbait. All right, this time it's for the title. Tight spot is... <laughs> it's a clickbait, but this time for it. 
Stone Cold. Stone Cold lost, but he wants revenge. We'll put Tight Spot in his corner. Come on, Sam. Best for beat Andy Papp, says Zipping Spider. Hard Day might get a contract with TNA. Uh, what are you talking about? Impact? Impact and TNA are the same company, sir. TNA got a streaming contract with uh, the same people that own WWE. I'm not quite sure what, what you're talking about, Dallas. Do, do, do. do you believe in the uh, theory that Vince Russo said uh, Vince to sabotage WCW to kill Monday Night War between the two? I mean, it makes sense. I just think people are dumb. I think a lot of people think they're more creative than they are. I mean, it would make sense, but I, I, I just think he's dumb. Because it would be different, like, if he went back to WWE, then maybe you have a debate. Or if he could, like, do something good with his life, it would be different. Like, if he if he started a company it was amazing, then maybe you have a debate. But I just think he's stupid and not as creative as he thinks he is. Might be time to make a Fatal 4-Way then. All right, TNA, with, that might be a TNT contract. It's here in rumors. And then TNA. Uh, I don't think so, sir, but maybe. I have no idea. Also, tight spot cash in on Haku. When he won the Twitch Championship, it's pretty a big belt. Yeah, Sam, what the hell? Is is the big belt on the line or not? Sam, Sam is the king of fucking busting. Holy shit. So if Andy Paps, if Andy Paps loses, you're putting a big title on the line? Wait, it makes no sense. No, no this makes sense. Fucking improve your booking, everyone. Improve your booking. <laughs> All right, so if Andy Paps wins, he gets a title shot. But if Andy Paps loses, he doesn't get a title shot or vice versa. I have no idea what's going on with Sam. Sam has the biggest belt in the land, and it's thing. The weird thing, he actually worked at WWE for like a month, quit, and then it was in 2002, and it invaded the storyline all over again with the real big players. Maybe. I just think he's too dumb. Like, if he found success somewhere else, I'd buy into the uh, conspiracy more. If Pap loses, I'll put my belt up. That doesn't make sense. So who gets the title shot? Paps? And I don't I don't understand this fucking looking at all. But you know what? That's what happens when you let fucking chatters be champions. <laughs> so what the fuck are you saying, Sam? Make it clear. If Andy Paps wins, what happens? <laughs> Why? Why is SmackDown losing Fox? Uh, Fox came out and said it. Um, WB fans are poor. That's the reason why they're losing it. Uh, WB gets ratings, but they can't sell sponsorship because it doesn't move product. Uh, anyone is saying best to say, if Paps lose, I'll give Andy Paps a shot. That doesn't even make sense. What would it be if he wins? You give him a shot? None of this makes sense. Why, why, cause then why wouldn't Andy Paps just fucking tap out right away? <laughs> Andy Paps is shot. I hear they might go to Channel FX. I doubt it, but it could be. I have no idea. All the TV networks are up. Up in the air right now. Alright, so... I, I, I... I... Dude, am I the only one that fucking Sam Besser is breaking your brain right now? Uh, am I the only one that's fucking brain is broken because of Sam Besser? This makes no sense. <laughs> I, I know. So if Andy Peps wins here, he doesn't get the big title shot? I, I don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> if I win, I should get a shot. Yes! You know, Coco, I don't think it was breaking my brain until you, it broke your brain. <laughs> Sam Besser's breaking my brain, dude. I don't get what's going on here. That's why AEW's got to put pay-per-views on Mac streaming. Ah, uh, yeah, they have to land a deal, though. So, I think right now everyone's looking to see where Time Warner goes. Time Warner, I think, has a lot of uh, power when it comes to pro wrestling and television. Now I try to explain what a broken brain in my first broken. All those epics did uh, F all, but artillery gained at least a level at least. Oh, nice. Thank you, Dark Metal fan. Try to stay up. We need you. We need you on that battlefield. Dark Metal fan, do you ever lurk and we go to Street Raiders to see yourself and be like, I'm proud of what I've done here today. 
I'd love it. Well, I would too, but as long as uh, internationally it's still on fight or Trilla TV as they renamed it. You know, how about specific Spider vs. Andy Paps to face for a title? I don't know. None of this makes sense. I, I have no idea. We're, we're, we're not let Sam. We're gonna have to let Sam explain what is going on. <laughs> I don't quite understand what's going on, but we got it. But we'll just have the results and then let let Sam is crazy. Yeah, I don't know what Sam is doing. Sam Sam has broke my brain. Uh, am I still on the Street Raider skid? Bad video and ages? Yeah, yeah, you are. We just never changed it. I po Oh, they got a missed! Oh, shit. They missed it, Sabu. Uh-oh. Sam Besser's a cheater. Sam Besser's a cheater. Oh, no. No. Sam, I... No. Kicks out Andy Paps has heart and determination. There we go. Jesus. Here we go. Alright, 1v1. This is for the YouTube title. Who's that Two of the greats at Coco Sports Stream going at it. Pokey catch. Gotta catch them all. He taps out! Andy Paps taps out the champ! Andy Paps taps out the champ! Dark Spectre, this Friday night, it's you in the main event. You in the main event, Dark Spectre, so make sure you're getting better. Drink that chicken noodle soup. Friday night is turkey mania. We all know Sam is a cheater. All right, Sam, I don't understand this. Hell's Gates gets him. 69, nice. I hope you're feeling better, sir. There we go. The champ just went down. Dark Spectre, that might be a good sign for you. You taking notes. I knew. What are you, lightweight champion? <laughs> In the YouTube channel. All right, Sam. So, so, Sam, what is the situation here? Does Andy Paps get a shot at the title? That was rigged. I'm so confused. Can, can someone, Sam, please speak into the microphone. Two-time dream champ. <laughs> now, it's, it's, the dream title wasn't on the line, but does he get a title shot or not? You think Sam just left? I think Sam just fucking left. God damn it, Sam. <laughs> I beat the champ. The pokey check not working? Oh, no. That's not good. Oh, it's already gone. Fuck it. I'll give it. What the fuck is going on? All right. This is what happens when you have a chatter. <laughs> and what type of match, Sam? Here we go. Here we fucking go. Oh. All right, all right, all right. Sam, what type of match do you want it in? No time limit. Entrance is on. We got the big boy, Jet. We got the big... This is just a road to Turkey Mania. Zipping spiders trying to... Can it be in Hell in a Cell? Dude, you, you're driving this fucking bus, kid. You're going to put a big title on the line. You're driving this goddamn bus. A Hell in a Cell. I am going to put a 20-minute time limit on it, though, because it can take it. Uh, that's up to that's up to uh, Sam. Sam has to okay. Zipping spiders pitching. Uh, Dave was a screw job referee. Rang the bell when Vince Man told him to. Screw job referee banged the bell. I'm not sure quite what you're saying. Was, was the screw job a referee? Paps only. Paps only. Matthew K. All right. Knockouts on or off? Knockouts on or off? And what are you dressed up as, Sam? Suit or no suit? All right. Knockouts on. You got it. Andy Paps, what are you dressed up as? This is the biggest title in the fucking lands, and it's only defended like once a month. That means it's going to be defended in two days. Suit. All right. White. Oh, shit. It's going down. All right. Knockouts on. Should we go 30 minutes? 30 minutes or 20 minutes? I don't want to go 60 because that might take him over. I don't know who to cheer for. 20 minutes? 30 minutes? We'll go in the middle. 25. 30? Oh, shit. Everyone's saying 30 now. I'll say... All right, let's do a 25. 25's in the middle. All right, some people say 30. Some people say... 
We cheer for the stream. All right. 25 minutes. Knockouts on. The big title is on the fucking line. Wake up, everyone. You goddamn know. This ain't even pay-per-view. It's free television. It's the road. <laughs> it's the road, too. Andy pa Oh, Jesus Christ. It doesn't get any bigger than this, boys. It does not get any bigger than this. Good luck following this match. Here we go. Coco Sports Championship. Andy Paps for Sam Besser. The road to victory road. The road to turkey mania. This is probably the biggest match we've ever had not on pay-per-view. Dude, all the podcasters, Cornette, uh, Russo, Jim Ross, are like, how can you give this on free television? What the fuck were they thinking? <laughs> oh, this is the biggest match in Coco Sports history. We are here at the Coco Sports Kingdom in Yokohama, Japan. There is the G-Man calling the action to the ring. It doesn't get any bigger than this, boys. After this, we got to go hockey. We can't top this. We might have to. We might have to go hockey. The women might get bumped. Does he get away Hogan versus Goldberg or free like when it's four days later? But it was like four days. Yeah, I know. Oh, this this is a Hogan Goldberg situation. If you win, I can add to the match on Friday. Four days noticed. I mean, there we go. Oh, this is eat your heart out. What I want NHL to be a pro. That's what we're probably gonna do. It's gonna be hard to top this. The YouTube champion coming on out. Oh my God. It's going to be hard to top this one, boys. It's time for the main event. The women are getting screwed. You know, all the people on Twitter are like, the women get screwed in Coco Sports Stream. We didn't expect the Hell in a Cell 1v1 versus the two biggest names in the goddamn business. Oh, uh, and how is this going to change Turkey Mania? Is Andy Paps going to be in it? Is it going to be a triple threat at Turkey Mania? Coco Sports Dream confirmed sexist. No! <laughs> Not all that, but a lot of people are keeping their jobs. Jeff Jarrett, Jeff Jarrett and Shark Boy are like, yeah, 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 bump, bump, bump the loser in Japan match. That's okay. <laughs> oh, shit. We forgot about fucking Stone Cold Tyson. Oh, no. I would run in and hit Paps with a chair. <laughs> if I went on the bed, both Sam and Dark Spectre at the pay per view, that's fair. That's fair. Hopefully Dark Spectre will be healthy. We also have another cash in. Fuck, we got a little too excited. We got a little too excited to jump to this one. Uh, do we go Tyson? Do we go Tyson? Yeah, hopefully Dark Spectre feels better, man. We miss you, brother. And thank you for being a part of our community. Oh, here we go. There's the champ. The chicken man has lost his shit. The chicken man. Even Paris is allowed on stream these days. Uh, she works night, so she sleeps during my stream. But yeah, Bear Fred, Bear Fred has been banned. There you go. That was for Andy winning. That's because of his screw job. That's true. That was for Andy winning. It's screw job. Got it, got it. Sorry, 13, 13 Kings style. All right. Did not expect this. The people at Yokohama didn't expect it. Look at that guy. He's about to lose his shit. There it is. Make it a four-way. Zipping Spider's trying to weasel his way in. Head cannon. Sam walks out to the chicken dance song. Hell yeah. My brother wanted me to do the chicken dance at my wedding, and I was too cool. I kind of regret it. If I went back in time, I would have did the chicken dance. Hype. And he perhaps hype it up. Here we go, boys. This is for the big one. Is this the first time this title has been defended on free television in our little universe? This might be the first time this title has ever been defended on free television. People are losing their shit. They can't fucking believe it. Ratings through the fucking roof. <laughs> Skyrocketing. Here's Andy Paps dressed in white. Looking like Wagner from Noah. I always bet you are down aisle to Rocky song. Gotta fly now. Hell yeah. And here he is. The good old chicken man. I, here's my thing. He is a champion at the highest level defending on free television. 
Does this mean Sam Besser won't be getting chanted chicken anymore? There'll be no chicken dance at my wedding. <laughs> Dumbo's like, I ain't doing it. I didn't do it, but maybe I should have. Here we go. It doesn't get any bigger than this, boys. Now, here's my question. Do we bump the Tyson match or do we follow it with this? I don't know. I think we might have to bump the Tyson match. Oh, Jesus. There we go. This should be this should be a three-way. <laughs> bump the Tyson match. Oh, Jesus. Here we go. 25 minutes of pure hell. Referee Crash Andrews. And here we go. The best tele the best match ever in the history of Coco Sports Stream that is not on a pay-per-view. No one understood what the chicken man was saying, but it delivered in one of the greatest moments in Coco Sports Stream history. There we go. If Andy Paps wins, I hate that animation. They do that animation way too much. Where like they throw him and he just falls. It's like, it's a weird animation. Tag team with me? Domo wants a tag team? Does anyone really understand what a chicken says anyway? Good point. Good point. There we go. We got 25 minutes. What happens if it comes to a tie? Alright, if how about this? Alright, booking on the fly. If it's a tie, Andy Paps is added to the pay-per-view. Andy Paps, does it ever, what do you guys think? Andy Paps added? 13 King Style said he was burying him on Confidential, being the company guy. I thought he's the best friend with Steve Austin, who was protected by him day one from getting fired by Vince. Also, another thing I like Jim Ross as a commentator is one of the great minds in the business. Had so to blunders as well. One of those blunders being a hypocrite to Steve Stone Cold. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not a big, I'm not a big uh, Jim Ross guy. Works for me, not added. Works for me. We'll have to give Sam Bess. Sam Bess will have to. Uh, okay, it's still his title for 23 more minutes and 12 seconds. It's still his goddamn title. Oh man, I'd be okay with it. All right, if it's a tie, you find your way to the pay per view. <laughs> Matthew K is like, how the fuck do I get in this match? That animation drives me nuts. I hope they get rid of it. And the thing is, in Hell in a Cell, they go to that animation all the time. They, like, throw him into the cage, and then he trips. They just... Like, once or twice a match, but I've seen it where they've done it six times in a row. Spoiler alert, you, you don't. Yep. Add me to the match in the pay-per-view, Sam. That's up to Sam. <laughs> like that? That right there. That animation drives me fucking nuts. <laughs> Sam! Sam busting Zipping Spider's balls! Zipping Spider's like, I want to be in a match! <laughs> Dark Spectre just recovering from being sick, but he'll be there for the pay-per-view. Oh! Missed it. It drives you crazy, too. I'll add Dave Coco to the match. I already got two matches, so you don't have to add me. Because... We, uh, Turkey Mania, we decide if we unlock Cena or not. And then uh, I'm also one of the bosses. Hey, we're off the Sauce 91. We're going to switch to hockey in a little bit. This is the biggest match in Coco Sports Stream history. Andy Paps wins by knockout. Andy Paps wins by knockout. That was Sam Besser's doing. We have the second champion. Oh, my God. Oh, my fucking God. Rigged. You rigged it yourself. Every bad decision. The boyhood dream. The first champion regains it. Andy Paps is the champion. We got it. Now, Spider. Spider and anyone else that wants to get in on this pay-per-view. You better cut promos on Andy Paps. Two-time Andy Paps. He won the first championship ever. And his average. Meltz did not like this match. Meltz did not like this match at all. See, and Zipping Spider saying, told you that to me. Melts shit on this fucking thing. Fuck Melts. Dude, Chicken Man fucked himself. Sam Besser fucked himself. 
<laughs> I want to thank Dave Coco. Ah, uh, thank you, thank you. All right, Rex, you got you got to thank Sam Besser. Oh, Sam. Papa wins. It's an L match. I win. It's a W match. <laughs> oh, here we go. Good old Sid's light. Paps, you know what to do. You know what to do. There you are. Oh, my God. And my boys at TNA. Boys. I don't know. This was supposed to be... This was just supposed to be free television. It was supposed to be Road to Turkey Mania. And now Andy Paps is the champ. There were, and it will be a three-way at at the pay-per-view. It will be a three-way at the pay-per-view. This is for my hot fucking wife and family. <laughs> Andy Paps is still giving speeches. My future unborn babies. <laughs> Andy Paps, let them know. Make it a four-way. That's up to the champ. That is up to the champ until Andy Paps loses the title. It was up to Sam Besser up until like 10 seconds ago. And now all the power goes with Paps. Oh, he's the YouTube champ, the Coco Sports champ. Oh, there you go. I want to thank my Lord Savior Jesus Christ. I was expecting that match to be a lot longer. Anyone else expecting that match to be longer? <laughs> Sam, are you okay back there? Sam, Sam just threw his couch through the fucking window. <laughs> he just picked up the couch like, ah! Oh, we got a Pokemon to celebrate. There is Andy Paps. The best championship in E-Fed history. It's not easy. Andy Paps, are you going to be a fighting champ? Uh, yo, Adrian, we did it. We did it. Andy Paps is champ. All right. One more match, and then we'll play some hockey, because that was a lot shorter than I thought. I'm going to go. Domo, respect the goddamn champion. There you go. Salute. Mr. Hilton Gaming, welcome to the Internet Infantry. I'm a retired loser in Japan who streams wrestling sports every day until January with a dinosaur named Raptor Man. Give this stream two weeks. If you don't like it in two weeks, I'll be mad enough to say give us two more weeks. Everybody, make sure that we are going exclusively on Friday night starting in January. And do you have a favorite sport, favorite wrestler, favorite pizza topping? Tell us something about yourself. And remember, the Internet Infantry is for life. Oh, there you go. Andy Paps has it in. Congrats, Andy Paps. I'll give you a match of pay-per-view one-on-one -on -one against the wrestler of my choosing. You can pick stipulation. There you go. Oh, all right. Should, you know what? Should we start with Tyson and end with Tyson? Should we start with Tyson and end with Tyson? I, I, We did have a cash-in. I don't want to screw too much. Two stars for Meltz. Meltz wasn't happy. Meltz was not happy. All right, this is for international audience. Um, Sam Besser, get your skates on. We're going to be playing 1v1 next. All right, 1v1, normal. There we go. Yep, yep, yep. All right, we started with this match. We're ending with this match. This is for the Twitch title. We also could do the women's title. I did not expect that match to go so long, that short. Mike Tyson, Stone Cold Steve Austin. We, 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 this time for a title. And we got to make sure we have more women matches next time. Shredder was deleted earlier. There we are. Championship match. There we go. Whoops. Oh, fuck. I forgot to put a timer on. And knockouts. Shit, shit, shit. I might quit this. This match might go too long. Hold on, boys. I fucked up. I fucked up. Andy Paps is partying and drinking. JB's talking to Paps backstage. What are you saying, Andy Paps? What are you saying to Jeremy Borash? What are you saying to J Jeremy Borash right now? Are you like, fuck yeah, let's make it happen. There we go. And also, uh, we need to know if, uh, if Sam Besser has his skates on. Sam, do you have your skates? These are things we need to know. Knockouts on. 10 minutes, Twitch title on the line. We, this is our clickbait match, and it's our prompt to main event after one of the greatest free 
matches of all time. We got Stone Cold Steve Austin versus Mike Tyson. Today has been a Mike Tyson type day. Let's see. I'm going to see what uh, two is. Championship. There you go. Not Stone Cold title. We got to get the Twitch title. All right, Twitch. All right. Let's go. Start the match. But before we start the match, we're going to go to Stream Raiders. Stream Raiders is free to play within game purchases. Uh-oh. Actually, I was thinking uh, it might be paused. Wait a second. Hold on. We'll come right back, Stream Raiders. Yeah, there we go. Yikes. All right, here we go. We paused it. We paused it. Good, good. Okay, we're good. We're good. I messed up. First time ever messing up. Also, if you're on the Twitch machine, make sure to hit command play. If you're on the YouTube machine, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And we're about to switch to hockey after this match, as long as we get the okay from Sam Besser. We're waiting for confirmation from former champion Sam Besser. Andy Paps, how does it feel to have the biggest title in the game? Everyone's trying to make challenges. Challenge me, nah. Challenge me, nah. Everyone wants to be the guy going for the title, but no one wants to accept. Hmm. There we are. We got two Larry Birds out there. Love to see it. Dark Metal Fan got 28 murders. See, Dark Metal Fan, you're up there. By the way, Stream Raiders, Command Stream Raiders. I mean, sorry, just Command Stream Raiders or StreamRaiders.com. Look for Coco Sports. And you can buy some skins. You can get the Larry Bird, the Coco Sports flag, a ton of different Awkward in Japans, EBU Football, and King Raptor Man. If we sell enough skins, our next skin will be um, a Raptor, a Raptor, uh, what's, uh, sorry, I'm stuttering. A Lucha Raptor, a Lucha Raptor next. There we go, back. All right, we got gold, blue, and then boss. Is Sam taking the loss pretty hard? I haven't heard anything from Sam. AJ, can someone check? Someone in Vancouver, check on Sam. See if he's okay. He's like, Mom, I thought I had this. I thought I fucking had it. Your mom's like, what were you thinking? It's like, I don't know, man. I thought I had it. I thought I had it. Uh, let's let's get it. Let's get a Slayer out there. Boom, boom, boom. And what else we got here? Quests. Oh yeah, baby. Love to see it. Get some artillery in there. Sam Best, are you good? <laughs> We might have to keep going with wrestling if Sam is MIA. If Sam is MIA, we might have to go with wrestling. Let out. We got Nobody Man, Hugsley, Dark Metal Fan. Love to see it. Let's go out there and keep kicking some caboose. All right. Oh, Mike Tyson. He's in his dress clothes. I'm ready. All right. So after this match, we'll do one on one v one, sir. You know I'm feeling froggy. Oh, it's, what? <laughs> Andy Paps, the first and the latest Coco Sports champion. Andy Paps, you gonna you gonna take on some challenges? I'm um, Sam Besser's the first chat. Sam Besser's the first champion that defended his title on free television. And of course, we got three. You feel? Uh oh, Eddie Pat's feeling generous. <laughs> I love that everyone wants a fighting champion until they're champion. Everyone wants a fighting champion until you, they're champion. Two days. What is it? Two days before the pay per view. Two days before the pay-per-view, losing the title? YouTube Battle Royal match? All right, we can do it if you want. The poor women get bumped. There we are. Maybe we can get a YouTube thing. 
I would never uh, be fake and hypocrite to my friends. I'm always loyal to my friends. I'm gonna say, oh, okay, got it. Yeah, yeah, that's what uh, 13 King style is. Yeah. Uh, it, uh, Jim Ross is just not a good person. And there's not many people in pro wrestling I could say that about. But people love him. When we get bumped, are you sure you're not taking advice from good old JR and becoming like Dunna V? No, no. The Dream Championship is being defended at the pay-per-view against Sam and Dark Spectre and only them. I just put his foot down. There we go. Three chatters in the main event at Turkey Mania. All right, fine. Book the women. <laughs> well, if we book the women, that means Sam might, get it, might have to wait a little bit. Sam, can you wait one more match before we go to hockey? Can we get, we got to give the women their moment in the sun. Can you wait one game, one match after this? We'll put a time limit on it. Did Sam just win Booker of the Year? I think Sam made us all shit our pets. I think I'm bad. Yeah. But yeah, as far as like being loyal to your friends, I feel like you should definitely be loyal to your friends, but you shouldn't have that many friends. That's a New Jersey thing. Like, I, I remember, like, uh, my Uncle Tommy would always say, you have more than five friends, you're a bad friend. Because a lot of people are like, I'm loyal to my friends, and I got 4,000 friends. It's like, all right, that's impossible. I'll give you more time to warm up. All right, I can't lie, though. My brain is still broke from the YouTube title match. <laughs> Me too, uh, Rex. <laughs> Me too. Uh, bad paps now. <laughs> Can't bad paps. <laughs> uh, Coco Reed, uh, give me a second, sir. Uh, I can't lie, bro. I'm the Rangers, and you're in Vancouver Canucks, and it's 1994, Sam. Uh oh, uh oh. Sam does you a favor, and you turn on him like that. You turn on him like that. <laughs> After everything Sam did for you, Sam gave you the opportunity of a lifetime. And, and you return it by attacking what he loves most? You're an evil one, Mr. Paps. <laughs> You're an evil one, Mr. Paps. You're the evil of the evil. Two count. Hold on, water and KFC. All right. Uh, FPR that uh, 1v1, if Paps gets timed. <laughs> If you win, if you win, I get timed out. Popeyes better than KFC? I haven't had Popeyes in 20 years. Second chicken getting taken down tonight. <laughs> oh shit! Eddie Pap's dad joked them. <laughs> All joked them. Uh, if I beat anyone from TNA, your choice. A person face me at the pay per view. You're still champ. I get a shot. At the Coco Tunnel. Do you agree with that? All right. Sipping Spider's trying to negotiate his way in. Man, how you order KFC at 11 p.m.? Uh, some of the cities stay up late. It's 122. Yeah. Usually if you live in a city, sometimes the shit stays up way later. All right. Back in the day, a lot of stuff was 24-7, but I think they kind of laid back. On it. Jesus Christ. Tyson might get the best of Stone Cold two nights in a row. I think Stone Cold's pit. I mean, I think Tyson's pissed. He's the Twitch champion. He already beat him at the clickbait and has to get a rematch. Can cash in on, on, uh, Jesus Christ. I love that animation. That animation never gets old. That animation never gets old. Jesus Christ. That's my favorite animation in the game. Two count only. So McDonald's BKs are open at like 2 a.m.? Yeah. I saw something weird in Kawasaki that I don't think I've seen in my whole lifetime. Mike Tyson wins by knockout! Probably because he's in a good area. Uh, uh, my KFC closes at 10 p.m. It doesn't make you shit after 9. Damn. There you go. Mike Tyson. He wins the clickbait. He wins the Twitch title. He wins the cash-in. Mike. And he's a goat. He's a goat at boxing. MMA, and now wrestling. Can we all officially say it's Mike Tyson Day here at the stream? Been a while the 11th Howl, how you doing? Is it 11 Howl, or is it 11th Howl? Or is it Owl? Like, whoo, whoo. Hey, man, how have you been? I haven't seen you in a while. We're got, next, uh, next month, we're going Friday's exclusive. 
Four stars. Doing well tonight? Uh, I'm doing really well. We just had a lot of fun with the E-Fed. And uh, I've just been in a really happy place. So, yeah. How you doing, sir? Any paps. Night, y'all. Yeah, you going tonight? Look at this motherfucker. Gets the title and goes to bed early. Coincidence? I think not. All right, this will be the last match of the night. We don't want to bump the women. The women get the main event. You know. Let's go ladder match. Uh, it's hockey. Oh, not one-on-one. Eight men. Yeah, yeah. Normal. Just ladder. All right, let's get some women in here. Give me a second. Title match on. Uh... Dakota Sky. Dakota Kai. Sorry, not Dakota Sky. Dakota Kai is the champion. We don't want to have sexism. No, no. We can't have the sexism. He's got a good night's sleep and he, he needs to retain the championship. That's on Survivor Series Fallout? Uh, I don't know. I, I just... I don't know. I, I, I don't hate it. I don't like it. It's just... It, it is what it is. You know? I'm, I'm just hoping it leads to good matches. Ah, uh, we got Mickey James. There you go. Rio, I spent the first 20 years of my life trying to have sexism. <laughs> There's Rio. Yeah. Well, see, a bug did sign with Raw a few days ago. Yeah, well, I thought that was pretty obvious. He was That was going to happen. Trish Stratus. All right. Feel free to list off some women that we have that might be in the game. Rio... Let's get some Trish Stratish up in here. Mercedes Monet. Mercedes Monet. And after this, me and Sam Best will be 1v1. Battling on the ice. Uh, we'll see you. YouTube, 13 King Style. You got anything? China. All right, let's get China in there. There we go. Wolf Knight's here, but Crystal Doink. Ah, oh, we couldn't download Crystal Doink. Uh, we have to delete someone. We didn't download her. So we'll get we'll have her for next next show. We'll have her for next show. We we were supposed to do more LIJ matches. Shayna Baszler. We do have uh we do have uh Wolf Mistress or whatever. I don't think it's Wolf Mistress. Wolf Goddess. EO Sky? Uh we'll go EO Sky. E O Sky. There we are. Yeah, I love you. Yeah, me too. All right, there we go. Title match on. Oh, whoops. We're going to have to definitely put custom rules match. Except we're going uh, 15 minutes. We'll go 15 minutes. There we go. Championship. Kogo Sports, Dakota Kai. There we are. Ian Kazan, uh, one of my favorite teams. Nice. There we are. Kushida signed with TNA. I saw that. That's amazing. Uh, hopefully, Kushida and TNA do some amazing stuff, to be honest. Oh, Kenny Hojo, I missed you, 13 King Style. I fucked you over, sir. Sorry. <laughs> I, I asked him for a fucking girl, and then I fucking forgot to look over. Too solid? Yeah. Too solid for Tina. I don't know much about that guy from UK, though. I got 15 minutes. Sorry about that, 13 King style. Well, currently it's Impact, but it referred to Tina. Doing hard to kill. Yeah. He was a, a mustache mountain. Got it. Yeah, I apologize. So, some of them I don't know. Has Nick Aldis signed anywhere yet? I think he's in WWE as a, uh, as a, uh, as like a uh, fucking like uh, Teddy Long character. I think he runs a show. Doesn't he run SmackDown? Yeah, he's the general manager of SmackDown. Let's see Magnus return. Yeah, yeah. Tight spot. Your guy got knocked out, buddy. So after this, we're gonna switch it. Ah, uh, shows how much I know. Yeah. Do you have any updates on your pro show working on? Uh, yes, uh, it's it's probably on hold, maybe forever. Um, me and my wife tried to buy a building, and uh, the government owns the building, and they won't sell it to us. So it's probably not going to happen unless something major happens. But we were going to buy a piece of property, 
and the government won't sell us the piece of property. It's because you're white? It might be, but I think it's just because the government is corrupt. Being white probably does not help, but it's also very corrupt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the land we were going to buy, uh, maybe I'll make a video on it, but the land we were going to buy, we had plans, and then uh, the Jap Japanese government won't sell us the land. So we had we had to say goodbye to that uh, plan. I apologize if you feel I let you down. It's just I figured I'd just tell you the truth. Yeah, we were going to buy land. We were going to put an American restaurant down below, a three-floor arcade. We were going to make a Shijuku face, a Twitch home, and then housing for our employees. And, uh, and then uh, they just wouldn't sell us the land. You never let me down? I appreciate that, sir. But I, I did have big plans. I was going to have a manager on every floor. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I was basically going to recreate Shinjuku Face in a great spot in Yokohama. But you can only go so far if you go to buy the perfect land. Big plans with big peepees? Yeah. So we, we just have to have smaller plans. Um, we have, we, we have to adjust the thing. What's Shijuku face? It's a very small wrestling arena in Shijuku. It's where Noah, DDT, a lot of people go there. And it looks really big on television, but in reality, it's kind of small. So it's just, uh, it's just a, a really, really, really nice wrestle house. Uh, if you watched Noah, DDT, TJPW, Dragon Gate... If you watched anything but New Japan, they've probably wrestled in Shijuku face before. Smaller plans with big BPs? I hope so. Tiny plans with extra big BP. <laughs> but yeah, our, our goal of starting a giant company came crashing down because if we don't get that land, such a, yeah, yeah, basically 2300 arena. Yes, sir. Uh, we wanted to build that on top of an arcade. And then have a Twitch home, an American restaurant, and the location was perfect. Everything was perfect. And the government said, fuck your dreams. Double salute. Joey Tattoos! Welcome to the Internet Infantry. I'm a retired loser in Japan who streams every day till January. Then we're moving to Fridays with a dinosaur named Raptor Man. Give this stream two weeks. You don't like it in two weeks. I'll be mad enough to say give us two more weeks. Do you have a favorite sport, favorite wrestler, favorite tattoo? Uh, tell us something about yourself. And remember, the Internet Infantry is for life. Our Melrose Ballroom. Maybe. I don't I don't know which one that is. Tension and Pop Out like small arenas. Me too, to be honest. I love small arenas. I'd rather have a small... As a promoter, I'd rather have a small arena and charge more for tickets than I would have a giant arena. Like, my last show ever was in a really fucking big place. And on on tape, it looked fucking horrible. It looked like no one was there. But we, like, made, like... I think, like, 10 grand in profit. But on tape, it just looked horrible because the arena was too big. It's in Queens... The Lightning Arena? Uh, yeah, we ran the Lightning Arena before, but no, that wasn't the last one. The last one we did was Dallas Bull, and it doesn't look that big until you're inside. Good day! How you doing, Froggy Jetstar1234? Appreciate the first time chatter. Impact LWGCW, do some stuff there? Oh, really? Yeah, I've done the Ice Palace, but I... Yes, and I've done Tropicana Fields. I used to be a... I guess... A pretty big local promoter in the Tampa Bay area back in the day. But now, I just sit at home and watch fucking simulated matches. Anyway. Current wrestler would be Swerve. All time would be Eddie. That's not bad at all, Joey Tattoos. That's a good first time chat. Oh, uh, you have to be, you gotta be kidding me. What's that, 11th Howl? We got about less than 10 minutes left for this women's match. You got to run the Trop before WWE. Uh, no, Tropicana was ran by WWE before me. Uh, WWE has been in Tropicana before, to the best of my knowledge. I know they always go to the Ice Palace. That'd be weird if I ran Trop before WWE. I got to see. I, I don't know if that's true. It might be true, but I don't know if it is. I apologize. But I think WWE has been in Tropicana Field before. Hell, uh, the Thunderdome was in Tropicana Field. But that was after me. Yeah, I might have ran I might have ran Tropicana Field before WWE. I don't know. 
I know they ran the Ice Palace a bunch. You might be the first one that did show up that with Bret Hart. Yeah, I was definitely the first one that showed up with Bret Hart. Thought we ran traffic jail for the COVID stuff. Yeah, but we're talking. I, I was a promoter in the early 2000s. Is it pay per view tomorrow or Friday? It's going to be Friday, sir. We're going to have one more. I, I just feel like more people show up on Fridays. At least it gives people a chance. Plus, the one of the challengers is sick. How do you play in a match? Uh, well, th this our show is ending soon, but we stream almost every day and in January going to February. In the beginning, you just a ask to be in uh, three or four matches. So just be like, I want this guy. But to get your own guy, you just have to be active. So if, if you're active here a couple days and then bam, you're in and then you can have fun. Uh, but if, if it's a real wrestler, you just got to wait and be like, hey, chat, who do you want? And scream names. Honestly, you could, you could try buying a small warehouse in Japan. Possibility, but this property was perfect. Like, it was almost guaranteed profit, but the government wouldn't sell it to me. Like, I I, I could, but I don't want to, like, I know this sounds mean. In my old age, I kind of want, I want the chances of failing to be very small. And if I got this property, it's impossible to fail. It's impossible. But if I go somewhere else, the, this, the chances of failing go higher, if that makes sense. Froggy Jetstar, appreciate you being here. I didn't screw Sam. Sam screwed Sam. I think you read that wrong. I said you read Trapper Kevin before WWE when you did a show with Bret Hart. That's a possibility. I don't know if that's true, though. Did they run Tropicana before 2006-ish? So I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know if that's true. It would be amazing if it is true. I'm putting it on my resume. But I don't know if it is true. Not that I'm aware of. Yeah, because all the events I went to was in the Ice Palace. Hold up. You can contract your friends at Fuji TV. Let them fund the project. Uh, kind of. But you need... You need... You need... Uh, you need a product. Like, you can't just go to Fuji TV and be like, Give me money for something I don't have a product for. You, you have to have a building. You have to have a ring. You have to have a roster. Like, Fuji TV, if if I go to Fuji TV and have nothing and say, hey, Fuji TV, sponsor me, they're just going to cut you out and do it themselves. Yeah, you need a product to sell to them first. Yes, sir. So, that's why the property was the most important part of the plan. And, uh, the Japanese government said, go fuck yourself. And I'm like, alright. So... We tried our best, though. We had lawyers. We 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 tried. And at the end of the day, the government said we ain't selling you the lands. I I don't know if they said white boy afterwards, but I assume they did. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We ain't selling you the land, white boy. All right, understood. Have a nice day. Yeah. So we tried our hardest and we failed. That's life. They try to fuck you with the price too? No, no. Uh, I don't think they would have fucked us with the price. I think they just fucked us by just not giving it a chance to buy it. Price never came up. They're just like we're not. They're like we're not selling it to you. All right. I mean, if, if you go to someone and say, "Hey, I'd like to buy that," and they say, "Fuck off, we're not selling it to you," the price ain't even a factor. You know what I mean? Let him make the, let, let, let's make the white guy pay at his price. Pro promoter question. Uh, happy Krampus. Uh, day, happy holidays, everyone. Happy holidays, WWE underscore AEW live. Cool name. Promoter question. What do you do when you have too many people trying to get into a small building? Uh, in the beginning, it's a good problem. But then you, you up the price. You up the price of your tickets. And you got to balance the price of your tickets to the stadium because you still want it filled. And then if you still have a problem, then you rent out a bigger one for a, a pay-per-view big event. So, you, I would always start at a smaller building, pack the place. If it's too many people, raise the price. If it's too many people, raise the price. Too many people, have a pay-per-view somewhere big. And what I mean by pay-per-view, I mean big event. I don't, you know. Oh shit, someone's going for it. Is that China? Is China going for it? China's all... Ah, uh, China had one more. 100 people trying to get 150 CP. Yeah, that's a good problem to have. 
Because all you got to do is make sure the fire people ain't pissed. Make sure the building ain't pissed. And then uh, just jack up the price. Might as well call the pay-per-view super shows. Yeah. But then that's that's what you do. But you have to be careful because if you run too many super shows, then your regular shows don't mean dick. But I, I on my on my level um, of promoting, I would say run run one building and then run a big building for big events, and then space it out perfectly. But you know, I also didn't have as much money to play with as Vince Russo, Tony Khan, and Dixie Carter. Yeah, I ran Bourbon Street all the time. Bourbon Street was our home base. Yep. But yeah, it was it was fun. But if you ever have promoter questions, ask me. Just remember, I was a promoter though in the early 2000s. So, and I also live in Japan. So, if you are ever going to promote your own show, uh, what I would do is I'd find someone that you look up to in a promoting business, volunteer and follow him around. See what you can improve, see what you can learn from him, and then start your own deal. Obviously, don't be a dick and steal all his shit. This ain't Twitch. <laughs> uh, what about the reverse? Probably like 150 people in a 200 seat building. Uh, fr free to charities, free to kids, uh, free for cops, free for firefighters. It's better to pack the place and, and help the community and get good words. Yo, Koko, what made you choose to Japan? Uh, I was stationed out here. And then I married the wrong woman and had kids with that wrong woman, got divorced, and I want to stay in my uh, children's life. And now I'm retired and live here in its home. So yeah, I basically was stationed out here in the Marine Corps. And then I got married to the wrong woman, had kids. And I want my kids to be able to contact me at any time they want. Uh, they're all older now. My, my, my daughter is probably older than most of my viewers. And, uh... And then, um... Yeah, so that's basically it. I had only two minutes left. Only two minutes left. Dakota Sky might might get out of here. China is only one spot away from getting it. But I like Japan. But I wasn't one of those super Japan guys. You know. Oh, Dakota Kai, my bad. Not older than me. That's true, Wolf Knight. How you doing, Wolf Knight? We're about to switch over to hockey. I think Wolf Knight might be streaming pro wrestling, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh, shit. Mickey James almost got her title back. One minute left. Or me, I'm 31. Yeah, yeah. You live in Japan. You're so lucky. I was never that guy. I like Japan, but I was never a, a Japan mark. So we're going to switch to hockey. But if you want to watch wrestling, make sure to check out our good friend Wolf Knight. So where would you... Uh, so where would you want a pay-per-view event for your promotion? Just wherever a big building is. Um... We would always use the Jewish Community Center and uh, that. We also did Daytona. And then the thing is, the biggest secret in promoting anything is you want the buildings to want you. Because we would have it where buildings paid us. Tropicana Field paid us. The Ice Palace paid us. The Jewish Community Center paid us. Bourbon Street paid us. You want to get popular and big enough and talented enough that they pay you. It's it's kind of like uh, the biggest secret in promoting. So basically, when a big building said, "Hey, can you run a show here for this much money?" That was it, and it's a draw. We ran out of time. Will I do a match for Turkey Mania? Will I do your match for Turkey Mania? Basically, not a Weibo. Yeah, I'm not a Weibo. Made champion over at Wolves too. No way, not a bad week. Eddie Paps, give yourself a Barry Horowitz. If that's the same Jewish community center I'm thinking of, that place with a big poster of championship wrestling from Florida on there. Uh, yeah, they, they championship wrestling from Florida was at the Jewish community center too. Rigged. Hmm. There you go. What's going on with my Elgato? Has my Elgato been fucked up all night? No, it's not. Just, it looks weird. I thought my Elgato was fucked, but it's not. It's just, just the game looks weird. Sorry about that, boys. All right. Greatest of all time. So we just... Melts. I don't understand Melts. Melts lost his shit. Melts lost his shit. All right. Tomorrow, road to Turkey Mania. Friday night, Turkey Mania. Sam, you better be ready for hockey. 
You uh, archive, like, comment, subscribe. Everyone on the live stream, stay tuned. We're gonna switch over to hockey. If you are a big wrestling guy and you say fuck Coco and other sports, check out Wolf Knight. He's doing wrestling. All right, just just the archive, like, comment, subscribe. With that, I am over.